good afternoon, my word. This is going to be an exciting show. First time ever I am here, I'm live, and we're talking about our first ever today's special value live on QVC, this time next week, okay? So can I just say a huge welcome to all of those of you that are watching. I know there will be a few of you watching from all around the world. This is the first time we've done a show like this. So basically, for those of you who've been watching in the UK and have been on the journey, we started working with QVC here in the UK back in September last year. We've been doing weekly shows with them. We've been getting loads of new people into craft and it's been going so well that they have agreed to do the very first craft today's special value in years and it is happening next Tuesday, 2nd of May. Now, for those of you, it's a little bit different how it works in the UK to how it is in the US. QVC is actually part of the same company as HSN in the US. So it's all part of a big company called Curate, okay, who own all these companies, okay? Now, HSN, when they launch a Today Special, it launches at midnight and runs right throughout the day. When QVC launch a Today Special, QVC here in the UK, it actually launches at 9 p.m. So it's like a reasonable hour of the night. We don't have to stay up till midnight. So it launches at 9 p.m. and it runs all the way through the day, through, through that night and through the next day until nine o'clock in the UK. Then they'll launch their next TSV for the next day. So it'll be no surprise for you to hear that our TSV is the amazing new Gemini 2. It is the first time anyone in the UK can get their hands on the machine. We've basically done it. Was a, it was a worldwide launch that we did with Curate Group. So HSN launched theirs. Uh, their big craft day was the 28th of March. You guys know I was out in the US. It was a record-breaking show for HSN. Not just in craft, it was a record-breaking TS launch when we launched at midnight. The atmosphere in that building was electric and thousands and thousands of crafters all across America have received their Gemini, have started crafting with their Gemini, joined the Gemini Club, which I'm going to be telling you all about. And now we are doing exactly the same here in the UK. It's the same sort of deal. I'm about to walk you through all of it. But finally, everybody in the UK can get their hands on the Gemini 2. You can get it, you can get the turntable, you can get into the Gemini Club. We've got the amazing exclusive ownership program. Again, I'm going to walk you through all of that. But not only that, we are replicating the craft days that HSN do in the US. So as you know, those of you that follow what happens in, in, over at HSN, once a month, at the start of the month usually, we have a huge craft day, do all of our big launches for the month, and that's why this preview show becomes so important. So you get a sneak peek at all the launches coming up, and then we have shows throughout the day with the different launches peppered on. Now up till now, we've just been doing one hour every week on QVC, sharing with you what's coming up. However, from May, we've put all of our launches onto one week, the 3rd of May, well, 9 p.m. on the 2nd, right through to 9 p.m. on the 3rd, we are going to be doing kind of like a mini craft day, and I've got four big hours throughout the day, so that's going to be at 9 o'clock on Tuesday night, and then I'm going to be with you at noon on the Wednesday. I'm also going to be with you, oh sorry, don't, that's not noon, that's midnight. <laughs> Come on, Sarah. So I'll be at midnight. We'll be redoing the Gemini at 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. I'll be doing a full hour again at 3 p.m. in the afternoon and 6 p.m. that evening. And I'll be rounding off the TSV if we have any stock left, which is a huge if, at 9 o'clock that night, okay? The next two hours are all going to be about you. It's going to be about showing you world launch after world launch after world launch, okay? So the great thing is, the HSM craft day isn't actually till next, the following week, the 9th, okay? So a lot of the brand new world launches that would be happening on HSM are happening on QVC the week before, which means that the first time you are going to see some of these massive launches is right here, right now, in the next two hours, which include a brand new Sarah Signature, a brand new Nature's Garden that you've never seen, a brand new ink pad launch, which I am bringing none other than Leanne, our head of product development in her side. I brought her in specially to this show, never done this before, never brought her into a preview. I wanted you to hear from the horse's mouth what is so unique and different about this product. So Leanne's gonna be here to walk us through all of that. We've got some amazing products, literally jam-packed into every one of these hours, and you're gonna hear about them first, right here, right now. Now, 
For all we haven't done these shows like this before in the UK, we do have a format that works an absolute treat, which basically means I get my craft on and do loads and loads of crafting. I have a crafty sidekick who chit chats with everybody and then gives everything away. I mean, I don't really think you can call it a job. It's my, but, but I'm going to be the one working really, really hard for the next couple of hours, and I'm going to be joined by the lovely Ben, who's basically going to chit chat with you and give you all my stuff. Absolutely. I think I've got... Hello, everybody. Thank you, Sarah. I've got the most important job, the most difficult job, because I've got to keep up with all your comments. I've got to uh, see what you guys are chatting about, pass on the excitement to Sarah. I've got to make sure I'm up to speed with where we are so I know what I'm giving away, when I'm giving it away. How do you win on this show? It's really simple. You just interact with us. You send us a message, you ask us a question, you let us know what you're looking forward to to the most and we will pick at random during the show comments uh, where you guys can win everything that we're going to be demonstrating and showing during the show it is going to be absolutely immense uh, don't forget the booklet as well 146 pages in the booklet this time around so you can have a good flick through get to items before we get to them see loads of inspiration and ideas before we get to talk about them um, you will find the link uh, where you're watching right now in case you can't see it, it's there on the screen for you uh, download the book have a good look through and it's certainly going to be your roadmap as to what's going to be happening uh, Tuesday night into Wednesday and indeed what's going to be happening over the course of the next couple of hours with us here. It's going to be super, super exciting and we have got so much to get through. Let's just say a few quick hellos. Top team today, I tell you what, uh, we've got Susie, we've got Rachel, we've got Taylor. Oh, so many people sending through the comments and I know we've got people watching worldwide as well. So lovely to have Patty here with us and Scott Greengrass is in. Hannah Gosling smith who was on the craft along yesterday, uh, says, ooh, Gemini 2, here we come. Absolutely. Uh, Tammy Barnhouse is so excited. Uh, Brenda Patricia Field says, hello from Tony Pandy in South Wales. Uh, Zoe Carver's in from West Sussex. First time watching one of these QVC shows. Excited to see what's coming. At least I know I can get this in the UK. Uh, Trisha Malion joins us. And hello to Angela Brown, uh, who is in from Ramsgate. Uh, worth bearing in mind as well, and when you do tune in to uh, QVC Free, Review 16 is the channel. If you're watching on Sky, it's 660. Or, of course, you can watch online as well at qbcuk.com. I'll remind you of all of that as we head through the show. Any questions, any comments, get in touch. I'll fire them Sarah's way. But let's get going with the most exciting launch I think I've ever been a part of. Let's delve in with Sarah and find all about the UK launch of the Gemini 2. Yes, so... For those of you that have seen a little bit, you've seen the sneak peeks of the products, perhaps you've watched some of our presentations over on HSN, the Gemini 2 has literally taken the craft world by storm, okay? Now, this is the official launch of the machine here in the UK. So, the Gemini 2 is exclusively launching on QVC on the 2nd of May. Sometimes their TSVs go live a couple of days before at the special pricing. The best way to keep up to date with all of the gossip, find out all of this, is if you are part of our fan group so we are rather innovatively called ben fans of crafters companion on qvc yeah right? and there's nearly five thousand of us in that group so you get in that group you'll find all the gossip as soon as items go live as soon as there's special pricing things like that they've all the details will be in that group that's where the community stuff happens okay but this is all about the gemini 2 now if you haven't seen about our gemini 2 i'm going to get ready and i'm going to show you a little video which walks you through our gemini okay now, we have sold over a quarter of a million Geminis to date. It is the die cutting machine that every die cutting enthusiast either already owns or aspires to own. And we've crammed so many upgrades into it. Have a little look at this, okay? There it is. So this is our Debbie with the Gemini 2. Wow. It comes with these glide feet, which I'm about to show you. But we also have a turntable available, which is coming in your package. Now, it's got these wings that come out with all the integrated storage and all of the plates that you need are included. It's faster than your other Geminis. It's more it, no, it's not more powerful. It's got the same power that you expect from any one of our Gemini machines, but the plates that are included give you this phenomenal, um, just this great cutting experience. Mm. Now, I will walk you through all of these new features that you are seeing on the machine, live on this machine, but needless to say, the thousands and thousands of people that bought this over in the US. Now, bear in mind, I said this earlier, it was a record-breaking Today's Special launch for HSN. That is not a craft Today's Special launch. 
That is a, that is a 30 day special. This was a record breaking launch for them just over a month ago. And thousands of you over in America bought the new Gemini 2. And I'm seeing the feedback every day on social, people who now own this machine, and I say it is revolutionary when it comes to crafting, okay? Mm. Now, we talked about these amazing glide feet on the bottom. So did you see how when I was using this, I was literally pushing it around yeah. on the surface like this? Incredible. Right? This is the beauty of it. It has these glide feet built in, okay? However, there is an optional turntable available as an addition. We have included your turntable in your package, okay? So if you want to work like this, oh, I've got an overhead camera. Hello, look I at this. Moved, I moved it out of the overhead camera, I'll come back in. Um, so if you want to work, the turntable adds onto the bottom and you can use this in a full rotating capacity so that you can pop your plates in, you can spin round and take your plates out at the same time, okay? Now, while I'm on this machine, Ben, you see they've got these little wings in it. Yeah, right? brilliant. These are your integrated storage. Okay. So all of your tools, your accessories will all sit in here. It's got this magnetic closure on the front. And have you noticed I'm sitting with the iPad on the top yes. of here? So you can watch your tutorial videos. Because you're going to be part of the Gemini Club, which we'll talk about in just a second, everything you need is on that iPad stand, and the media stand is built into this. Now, I know what you're thinking. That's fine, but my battery on my iPad only lasts a few hours, okay? Notice this is plugged in to the USBs down Brilliant. here. Brilliant. You have three USB ports which will power any of your other devices or any things which we may develop in future. Ooh, here we go. I'm not saying any more, <laughs> but that is all, it's all built in. So you can power, you've got the power source coming into the Gemini. Your Gemini becomes like an extender cable power source for any extra accessories. I'm not saying any more that we will build into this okay. in the future, okay? Now, what I love about this is just the same as your other Gemini machines. It's got an on-off switch, it's got a pause, and it's got a reverse switch on there as well. The difference is now we have a full-length optical sensor. So you can't see the sensor. What happens is when you offer your plates in it, it used to be that we offer the large plates in it, they must operate the full width of your Gemini. Now what you're going to find is you can put your smaller plates or even your tiny little mini plates. Anything will fit through because you've got a full length optical sensor taking that right through. We've also made massive enhancements in the inside of this machine, okay? Now I made a commitment when we launched the Gemini. I said that we made the decision to put all of the pressure that you possibly could into that Gemini machine. Yep. Which means I could never bring out a Gemini with more pressure because it's not put, we've put all the pressure that you can get into it, okay? So actually, this is not delivering any increased performance. If you have a, a regular Gemini machine, you've got all of the pressure and power and performance that you can expect. That doesn't mean that in the last eight years, we haven't seen huge upgrades, Ben, in the technology that goes yeah. into these machines. Mm -hmm. And it's really to do with the gearing and the motors that are inside this machine. So what you've got in your brand new Gemini, okay? You've got that, um, it's, the motor itself is quieter. So you'll see when we operate, it's a little bit, in fact, I've got a, I'll put some of these plates through. Oh okay? yeah, some listen. It's kind of like a small humming noise, is okay. the best I can tell you, right? So if you put your plates in, I haven't got any dyes in here, but you, off, you pop your plates into the Gemini machine, okay? You'll see they automatically engage. They will feed right through. This is the one with the turntable on the bottom. They're going to feed straight through, straight out of the back of the machine. Oh, oh, man, do you know what? Do you know what? Sometimes, Ben, it just pays to actually do things the right way instead of, you know. What have you done? Well, I didn't put all the plates in, did I not? Oh, so okay. Right, let me offer these in properly. Mm -hmm. So, let's imagine that we have a full set of plates in, right? Let's, put the, let's imagine that we have a, a, a die in the machine, okay. right? When you offer these, and there's still no die in, but at least I've popped all the plates in now, okay? This is going to feed through, and what it will do is it will feed through, it will come all the way and out the back of the machine. Can you hear that, Ben? I mean, it's, it's almost silent. amazing, isn't it? Whisper quiet, and already lots of people getting very, very excited uh, about the machine. Uh, June Woodhouse says, I need, I want, 
I love. Um, Samantha Leahy. Hi, Samantha. Uh, saying, love the turntable feature. Again, an absolute must. Just makes it so much easier, doesn't it, to kind of use and retrieve those plates once they've come through. Bethan says, I don't have an electronic Gemini. I may as well start with the latest model, and I love the sleek new look. Does look the business as well, doesn't it? All these new features looks the absolute business as well. Uh, and lots of you chatting. I know Sarah will get onto those as well in more detail. Chat about those tool trays as well. And a few comments coming through. Uh, that a few of you are not thinking about storing tools in the tool trays, um, but lots of you thinking about putting snacks in them um, as well. They're there for whatever you want to use them for. Uh, but we'll delve into those more with Sarah in just a second. But yes, there are lots of comments coming through just saying just how whisper quiet that machine is. This is the beauty of it. So it's quieter, it's faster. And what it says, a lot, what a lot of people like is, it's just, we've just brought the machine up to date with the latest technology. That's the beauty. Yes, it's got the bells and whistles. It's got those lovely compartments. It's got the wings. It's the fact that it's going to hold your plates at the back as you work. It's got the media stand. It's got the turntable options. It's got the glide feed. You've got the USB ports there. It, we really are. We've, tr we've tried to take a machine which is already pretty close to perfection yeah. and just give it a polish and bring it bang up to date and the response so far from the crafting community has been off the scale now i will warn you what happened over in uh, america we had a record-breaking launch we had a complete sellout by, I think it was mid-afternoon the next day, and that was including us rustling together, bringing as ma putting as many machines together. We sold out of what was the Today's Special Bundle, and then people were paying the same price but only getting the machine, right? I can tell you now, QVC in the UK have not ordered as many units as what HSN did. Yeah. We have a bigger following and a bigger customer base here in the UK than we do in the US. I know the market's 10 times bigger there than it is here, but we are a UK business. We've been established here in the UK for many, many years. We do not have as many machines at QVC as what we had at HSN. I want to give you the heads up because I know those of you who are watching this show will be the super hardcore Crafters Companion fans, the ones who have already done all their research, they know how awesome this machine is. You will be waiting to get this at the best price, the best deal in the market, and you want to know what's coming in the kit with QVC, and you want to make sure you don't miss out on that bundle, okay? I'm going to tell you, I'm going to walk you through exactly what comes included, okay? Okay, yeah. So you get that, you get the actual machine itself. And the machine, now we have come, the slight difference between the one that we're doing for QVC and the HSN one, it comes, the, uh, at HSN we pre-fit all of the turntables onto the bottom. Yep. For QVC, we are sending your turntable as an extra so that if you want to people like this with just the glide feet. So you're not paying any extra for the QVC, you've got it included, but it's up to you whether you want to add it on or whether you want to use it as the glide feet. Your choice, okay? You've got that choice there. You are getting it, you are getting all of the plates. Now I do just need to talk about the upgrading technology on the plates, okay? We have seriously invested into a, a lot of R&D in the plates. We have produced the new plates out of a different type of plastic and a one that will absorb all of the, a lot more of the pressure that you are getting from your Gemini. Yep. Now, if you are a good, diligent plate user, <clears throat> I'm not, Leanne, <laughs> she's perfect. Of course right? she is. She remembers to turn and water. I shouldn't talk like this because she's just outside. She'll she's be literally in just outside the door. Uh, literally, every time she uses turn and rotate, turn and rotate, okay? When we do our life testing on the plates, we do them based on a turn and rotate every time we use it. Full life testing on one of these plates shows that it lasts three times longer than one of our original Gemini plates. Three times longer. The other plate which has had a significant upgrade is this one here. You can see it looks, it's a completely different material. This is, it was frosted and white on the other one. Still frosted, but it's not white, it's frosted and clear. Yeah. The life testing on this is this is 10 times the shelf life. This will go 10 times longer than your original frosted plate. So those of you who do a lot of 3D embossing, things like that, you're gonna use these a lot. It will absorb, it's designed to absorb a lot more of the pressure. So all of your plates are included, massive upgrades on the plates as well as upgrades on the machine, okay? Now, when this launches into the rest of the market, the UK market, uh, it's the machine that will be coming as a machine, no turntable on the bottom, just the standard machine with the glide feet, with the plates. That is the standard bundle. 
The additional value add that we have is the today's special value at QVC is you will get the machine, you will get the bundle, you get the turntable on. So it's going to nice. already have that functionality if you want to do the spin on there as well, okay? We then have access to the Gemini Club, right? Now, those of you who watched the previews in the US will know all about this now. The Gemini Club, now it's £50 to join the Gemini Club for regular non-Gemini Club owners. Oh, I'll keep the details up on the screen for you. Uh, you there you go, today's special value. So, this here will give you access to the Gemini Club. So what happens is, on the underneath of your machine, you have a, yours, we've took ours off here, has a sticker with a serial number on, okay? Because I, I can't let you see the serial number and then everybody will be joining the club with, oh, yeah. with my serial number, Gemini, right? Your serial number will be, you're gonna write it under here, mm -hmm. you go onto the special website that it tells you about, you pop your serial number in, it acknowledges it, the website is already pre-registered with all of the serial numbers of the machines that are part of the today's special value bundle. So what's gonna happen is, it, you're gonna put your serial number in, it's gonna come up and go, ah yes, bought from QVC UK, you have access to the club as part of your package. Brilliant. Then you'll pop your details in, it will sign you up for the club, it'll give you all the details of the club, you are there, then therefore in the club. Then also, as a value add bonus, you are going to get sent our Butterflies and Blooms collection. Amazing. Now, these are the boxes of a signature product we have yep. developed to go with the Gemini, which are completely exclusive to the HSN QVC group, okay? Now, when we did, I just need to explain this in a little bit more detail, right? When we did the launch on HSN, the box that you got included with your uh, today's special was the True Love collection, okay. right? Mm -hmm. The first auto ship was Butterflies and Blooms, okay? For those of you watching in the US who are just liking to see what's going on in May, over here in the UK. Um, if, so those of you in the UK, slightly different, but it still works out the same. You don't, instead of having the auto ship as part of your today's special, the auto ship is a separate unit that you buy an add-on and it's to do with the fact that if you had all the ship you couldn't have the flex pay on your machine they wanted to give everyone the flex pay so that this is separate so you still get this as a freebie right so this is coming included at no extra cost in your today's special yeah if you want to get the auto ship you buy the true love box and then you are in the five part future auto ship that comes with it so let me just show you what's included in the butterflies and blue Ooh, don't you be going off the side oh, there yeah, for goodness sake. let me show you exactly what's included here right so if i open this over oh it's such an amazing collection Ooh, it really is amazing okay so you've got on here you've got the uh, the beautiful stamp selection you've uh -huh. got stamps and dies you've got more butterfly stamps and dies some lovely uh, sentiment stamps here some extra die cuts we've got stencils in this one edgeable dies you've got embossing folders corner dies accessory dies yeah. i mean it's massive but it really is massive and um, then you've got the edge pieces and the stamps that go with you've got all of these gorgeous patterned papers and you've also got a beautiful selection of linen oh, cardstock that comes in there as well, okay? So I will show you the boards for everything in the Butterflies and Blooms collection. So remember, this is what is coming. Oh, and you get some um, core cardstock as well. You get the, all of the matching linen cardstock that goes with. Let me just get these, because I think it's much nicer when you see yeah, these, absolutely. right? Uh, let me bring these in one at a time. So you've got the lovely stamp set with that. But this is just absolutely gorgeous, oh, wow. right? Then you've got this set here. Now this is beautiful big stamp with the edge cut piece down here as well. We've then got all of these lovely sentiment stamps that go with it as well. Yep. You've got the beautiful butterflies with the matching die cuts that go with. This corner, can I just add Ben? Uh, liftable wings on oh, the butterfly. Oh, amazing. You know we love, the, we love the liftable wings, right? So you've got that beautiful corner panel with the liftable wings that matches the edgeable die, oh, okay. which you're going to use a lot. And it also matches this one here, which is a two-part, a creator card. Now, again, all these wings lift. Just love these. I mean, Leanne's team have done an outstanding job on the design of these. Oh, you can either cut in or you can cut out. So these are the three that perfectly match each other, okay? Then you've got an extra set here of beautiful florals that you can die cut. We've got lovely, so you could have wishing you a lovely birthday, 
have a lovely birthday to my lovely friend hello lovely you've got an embossing folder here as well you've got beautiful stem um, stencils in the collection too you've got three colors of linen cardstock but across the whole pack and then there are all of the beautiful papers that we were just looking at they are absolutely good and all of these double-sided amazing double-sided really nice kind mm -hmm. of um mixed media style papers on here okay that is what is coming included in your Gemini 2. I do just want to give you the details for those of you that want the auto ship. Now it's really important, I've pushed really hard with QVC. They don't do auto ships in the same way that HSN do. And I, I said, we really need to start and do that. So if you get into the auto ship, there is the details. Now it's gonna be running alongside the today's special value, okay? Yeah. So you, you need to buy it as a separate item and that is what comes on auto ship. Now, once you're in the auto ship program, same as everybody else across America, you will get your auto ships delivered every two months. So every 60 days, you'll get the next auto ship. So let's have a little look at what's coming up in your auto ship. So in August, you will get the bundle of joy, which is all about our beautiful baby sets. Look at how fabulous everything looks there. Uh, in October, we've got the winter wishes collection coming in with this one. And again, you always get the dies, the stamps, the embossing folders, all the matching pieces. Now, Seize the Day is the one that everyone got so excited about mm. when we were in the US. Beautiful for some male theme cards, the nautical theme there. Personally, I love the Perfect Harmony. Now, this is coming up in February Ooh, next year, so we're giving you a whole year's worth of crafting with this. And then the last one in the collection, if you want, comes in April 2024, so basically April next year. Then you will get the Celebrate the Day. Now, what I love is, bear in mind with QVC, everything you buy is on a 60-day money-back guarantee. So you can get this, you can have it delivered, you can try it and see what you think, and then if you don't love it, you can send it back to us. But if you are not in that authorship program this time round, you will not get this. This is like literally one chance to get in that authorship program. So does that make sense for everyone, Ben? Are there any questions about that? Uh, do you know what? It's just excitement more than anything, Sarah. So much love coming through for this. So many excited comments. Um, I, I think there's going to be a lot of people jumping in and grabbing this. Um, there is a lot there, says Trish Air. Gareth Dobbs says, I want, I want, I want. Uh, Angela says, this looks amazing. Um, and loads of love as well for the authorship coming through. Um, Bethan as well making a really good point saying that iPad holder perfect for doing craft alongs as well of course yeah because you can just uh, watch us craft along I know it's all been thought about it's all been thought about um, and Lily of the Valley says you know what it doesn't even matter that I have five cutting machines I need this one in my life make sure you are watching at uh, Tuesday night nine o'clock the official launch of that at uh, the TSV running the 24 hours it ain't gonna last that long uh, so you'll need to be in swiftly now here's the exciting thing um, on these shows I get to give away everything that we show now that the Gemini 2 you're probably thinking there's no way there's no way Ben's gonna give that away well I'm not gonna give it away right now but we are going to give away uh, everything that comes uh, in the TSV the bundle at the end of the show so uh, keep watching it will be signed for you as well so make sure you keep watching make sure you keep commenting and we will pick somebody at the end of this two-hour preview show to win the Gemini 2 how incredible is that that now very exciting in just a little while get a very special guest joining us for the first time ever in one of these preview shows but before all that uh, we're going to have a look at another brand new collection uh something that i do quite often actually have mediterranean dreams wish i could go off to the the mediterranean but i think sadly this is the closest i'm going to get to the mediterranean this year which is not a bad thing sorry because this is a beautiful collection you're about to show us it is indeed and it is a one of those world launches okay so if you if you weren't here right at the top of the show and you missed me explaining okay so for the first time we are kind of doing the HSN style one show for the month but it's happening a week earlier than HSN it's happening at QVC so a lot of the products that you are going to see featured in the shows on QVC on the second and third you'll be seeing for the first time ever it's all of our May launches are all launching on QVC on that day so we've literally got new product in every single hour now it's going to be a big feature product every hour this is the big feature product for us in the three o'clock hour now nature's garden collections are where we bring everything together that matches some beautiful papers with uh, designer embossing folders and stamps 
nice and die cut and all the accessories that you need to go with it so let me just show you the kind of feel that you've got in this collection mm -hmm. okay it's very italy i should say it's very sicily oh, right yes. it's that it's that lovely and it's uh, it's very bright it's vibrant it's happy it's lovely colors you can see that you've got the beautiful background papers we're going to talk about lovely edgeable designs on here we're going to be working with kind of um like core pieces, Ben, die, die cuts and embossing folders. Uh, but then also you've got things like your gorgeous edgeables. Look at this one. Your edgeable designs coming down the side there. Yeah. The little splash of the papers that you get included. Whether you want to do basic Ooh, cards or wow. you want to start and stretch it a little bit further, yeah. this is all the look and feel that you are getting in there, okay? Now, what we've done for QVC is we've put together a bundle which has a little bit of all of the stuff that you need in the range, okay? So let me just show you. And by the way, the best way to find out exactly what's in every bundle, what's available, is to download the booklet, yes. okay? I feel like everybody in the US understands this. We've been doing these booklets for years and years and years now, and people know, download the booklet, everything you need to know is in there. It's the same now for QVC. So if you, there's the booklet link, or wherever you're watching us live on YouTube, live on Facebook, you can click on the link, just wait till after the show. You don't want to miss anything exciting, right? Click on the link for the booklet. That will take you to that booklet. The booklet gets updated live as things go live on the QVC website so that you can click straight through from the booklet. You can shop the booklet, basically, to take you straight to the website. But it will show you exactly what is in every bundle and what you might want to go for as an extra. For example, I'm going to show you what's in this bundle. But you are able to get the luxury linen card and a 12 by 12 version of the paper pad as an extra if you want. So you can see there, Oh, there's all the details on the on your screen, but don't you worry about remembering on the screen. They will all be in that booklet. Of course. So, if I show you the paper pad to start with, right? This is look at the designs. This is the B track. That's the underneath side there, guys. Look at how gorgeous all oh, of these yes. designs are. So whether you want the really big, bright, bold patterns, uh -huh. or you want these lovely kind of sut subtle designs on the background, they work really, really well, whichever way it is you want to go, right? It's a really gorgeous design. So you get in the bundle, nice, gorgeous. the six by six pad, yep. right? You also get that edgeable die that I was showing you now designed to be paper pieced if you want to paper piece your lemons into there mm -hmm. you'll see you also have a second edgeable which is just a beautiful kind of ornate edge pattern on there as well we've got this nice mediterranean background embossing folder a 3d background embossing folder i might add on there as well then i mean it wouldn't be one of our collections without having all of the um the cheesy sentiments Go like on. when life gives you lemons make lemonade I could just squeeze you, <laughs> live your zest life. Love it. <laughs> the zest is yet to come. Honestly, they just, they just, the it, it gives you a way. If you we'll love making down. this style of card, it gives you a way to bring this style that you want, but make it relevant to whether it's a seize the day card or whatever it is, gives you a reason to make that card, okay? Yeah. And then we have the most beautiful stencil. Oh, if you wow. want to do some beautiful background work on here, okay? So the stencil comes included. Now, if I just show you, if you love that, you can go for the extra, the Mediterranean Dreams papers. They are gonna be, you know, they will be live during the show. You've got the lovely linen card, and then you've got the same paper pad, but in the lovely 12 by 12. Now, I know for a lot of you, this so will lovely. be, this is brilliant if you're doing scrapbooking, yeah. but these lovely background papers, they're gonna be great for all of your kind of core cards, just using small pieces mm -hmm. in one of the cards, okay? Now, what I wanted to do is just put together a nice, quick and easy card to show you what you could be doing with this collection, Fabulous. okay? So what you might be doing, as you might be telling, I've, I've done a nice, take a nice base six by six card here, right? And then the die that comes with, this is it here. So you can see there, it starts cutting here, finishes cutting here, this half cuts out, this half stays connected. Yeah. So if we open this up, lie this down, you can see it's going to cut right off the end of the card. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold that in place, Ben, with a tiny little bit of tape. And then we can send that through your die cutting machine, okay? Now, yes, I've got my Gemini, so watch this. Oh, here All we I go. do with my Gemini, I'm showing off now. I'm going to lift. Oh, there's, there's Leanne getting ready in the wings. Sneak peek coming up. Uh, Gemini <laughs> opens up, right? You can see there, I'm going to get all of my. Here we go. I'm going to get my. Uh, we're going to cut into the base cutting plate. Yeah. Oh, first time you're seeing the Gemini 2 in action. You're going to see my clear. 
we're going to add the magnetic into here we're going to go with the top plate on there and we're going to take this and it goes and straight into our gemini 2 machine now you can see there i'm actually not using the media stand this time so i've got no need for it to be standing up just so you've got well, that option you need to catch the plates now you've got like the little lips that oh, fold out no. now, look, i'm using that. this with just the glide feet on so i've just turned that right round now yeah you'll see when it gets to the end the beauty of this is it holds those plates there ah. at the edge until you're ready to take them out yeah. and then that glide just put it back into place means that you're not getting up and down from your seat to be able to do this okay so you can see there i've taken this here what you'll see is can you see it's done all of the embossing all of the detail into them and then what you can do ben is if you if you were to leave this in all right let me just take the uh, paper off if you're to leave that in you can see you've got a stencil here uh, that course. you can do all of your coloring in the middle of mm -hmm. so you can see on this one here i've actually done this where i use the die cut yep. to hold into place we've got our shimmering pads coming up we later on the show uh, and we, you can do a little bit of stenciling into here and you can see i've got that gorgeous there it is that yes. lovely shimmer effect going on with this now what i love about this one is let me just show you i'm going to take a bit of acetate right and this i'm going to stick inside the card so holding this in place here okay. right getting that like take this round and now i've got acetate behind here right because all these pieces that come out save these your little oh, lemons course. right so save all of your lemons I've actually done my lemons and I've coloured mine in, right? So that now I've coloured them in and I can paper piece these back into place. That is amazing. In all of these. Is this this one here? Uh, she says up to me. Yes, that one's going to go into them. Uh, this one comes down into here. Uh -huh. And then my last one in place there, Ben. And just look that this is fabulous that these have been pieced back into place. Beautiful. And then by the time you add a couple of little more extra embellishments and accessories, this is the sort of card that you're making. But how fabulous does that look? Amazing. It's a gorgeous collection. It's like a holiday in a, a craft kit, isn't it? It's absolutely beautiful. I'm speechless and I'm in love with the lemons, says Lily of the Valley. Uh, I adore how different this collection is to everything else I, I have seen in my collection, says Charlotte. Uh, chances of being able to resist any of this? Zero, says Kate McQueen. I have the breaking strain of a Kit Kat. Uh, a lot... A lot <laughs> that's a common one from Kate. I'm used to that phrase. I love it. Uh, Nicola and uh, Liam are laughing in the gallery. I've not heard that one before. Uh, and Kim says, no more plate catching roulette. Another genius thing about the Gemini 2, of course. Uh, Christina Clark says, I don't want this. I need this in my life. Uh, and I love the uh, catchphrase from June. He says, don't be a lemon. Tune into QVC on the 3rd of May. And the 2nd at 9, of course, don't forget, uh, for the TSV. As promised, I'm going to give the collection away uh, just for commenting. Congratulations to Christine Turner um, on Facebook. He says, I love these papers and the bundles. Christine, you've won the collection. All you need to do is message us uh, at QVC Prizes at crafterscompanion.co.uk and we will get that sent out to you. Well done keep commenting everybody more prizes to give away just a quick little mention for something that we've got coming up in the six o'clock hour on um wednesday if you're someone who struggles with uh, sort of more advanced cards if you like uh, this collection is going to be absolutely for you it's our everyday uh, shape card bases where you've got the ability um with the cards that you've got in here and then also the stencils with your mats and layers on top to not only create the cards nice and easily but then to have your mats and layers on these as well so within the bundles you've got the ability to make uh, your step rocker cards uh, you've got your uh, double diamonds in here as well i'll show you these all on boards in just a second but you've got your double stepper and then the step card in here too um, and what you've got if i show you on the boards uh, what you're going to get within each of the collections are your um, your cards, pre-cut and scored shaped card blanks. And then what you've got alongside that uh, is the ability to add your mats and layers with the stencils provided too. So just a great way for you, particularly as well if you are a beginner, uh, to be able to create these um, more advanced card shapes, like, for example, um, the step rockers. I mean, everybody loves a uh, rocker. You'll have the ability to do this really easily. And again, no scoring, no measuring, no kind of 
having to worry about can I do it because absolutely yes you can uh, you can really really super quickly put concept cards like this like the double diamond together really really easily and honestly if you are new to this and you're thinking there is no way on earth I would ever be able to do that right now you can with this collection that's the point it just makes it nice and simple for everybody and the final shape you'll be able to make um, is this one just here and as I said if you think about all of the different papers that you've got all of the different cards that you've got um, in your craft room right now you can create amazing uh, different shape bases um, and you've got the envelopes with these as well uh, to send off for all sorts of different occasions those are going to be coming up in the six o'clock hour on Wednesday uh, so do make sure you tune in for those as we've already mentioned you can see already in the booklet lots of ideas and lots of other samples as far as uh, that collection is concerned and of course all of the times that you need for the shows uh, coming up uh, Tuesday of course the big launch at nine o'clock and then on Wednesday uh, right throughout the day starting at midnight then 9 a.m. 1 p.m. 3 p.m. 6 p.m. and 9 p.m. it's all in the booklet though for you all laid out uh, so do make sure if you haven't already do check that booklet now very exciting for the first time on a preview show uh, we have a, a guest to uh, show you this next world launch and you know what I think it's really important to get Leanne in here because uh, to hear from uh, the head of product development the lady who was uh, in there who's behind these brand new duet uh, ink pads I think it was a brilliant brilliant shout to ask Leanne to explain us all around this so Leanne uh, thank you for coming because I know you've had a busy day already uh, but lovely to have you here on our QVC preview show. Well, thank you for having me and for inviting me along. I'm so incredibly honoured to be here to talk to you about these amazing new ink pads that are coming to you next week. Wherever you are in the world watching, whether you're going to be watching them on QVC or in the USA over on HSN, they're coming to you and you're going to be able to access all of these brand new techniques. Now, beautiful colours, tick, the new... new <laughs> Get your words, get your teeth in ergonomic yes. shape, Leanne. Now, if you've seen our shimmer ink pads, you know that these nestle beautifully in the palm of your hand. Where would you like me? There you go. Nestle beautifully in the palm of your hand so they're nice and comfortable. I know what you want to know is what is different about a duet ink pad. A duet ink pad is a fusion of a water reactive pigment and a chalky chalk ink yeah. so that it will separate and give you that weathered look where you can get beautiful deep enriched pigment color that will blend and move and work with water but then when you add water it separates out into a white look and feel so they give you opacity like a pigment ink pad but maneuverability like a water reactive ink pad it's bringing them both together and adding that extra white chalk finish in there that really does make them the most incredible technique based ink pad that we have ever and I make no bones about it wow. brought to you yep. in the Spectrum Wild Crafters Companion range. Let me show you what I mean by that. Here is a piece of white cardstock that was inked up um, with the, uh, the ink pads that we've got for you okay. and you can see the opacity on there is absolutely exceptional mm. and you've got those beautiful colour ombres and that started as white cardstock so beautiful blendability when you add your water and you start to do your effects rather than getting the full bleached look oh, you get this fantastic almost magic kind of separation yeah. of the colour with that white halo, that chalky effect, which really is exceptionally beautiful. When you use them through stencils, the blendability and the ombre you get in the colour, the deep, sharp opacity, almost printed look you get is absolutely second to none. They are so beautiful, beautiful to use. All of the techniques that you can do with a pigment ink pad, a quick dry ink pad, a Harmony Water Reactive ink pad, all of them can be done with this one duet ink pad. So it brings together all of the family and puts it into one ink pad for you and then adds that beautiful reactive chalky finish. So let me show you how quick and easy they are to use. Amazing. I've just got a piece of regular watercolour cardstock here. Uh -huh. And we're going to blend an ombre. Now, I just like to go straight in with my ink onto the card from the ink pad. And I like to get a good amount of that colour down. When I've got that colour down, then I need to blend that out. Okay. 
Um, so I will just blend it out and smooth it out. Now I can pick up extra bits of colour to fill in the gaps uh -huh. from my ink pad, but taking the ink pad direct to the card straight away <laughs> allows you to get intense colour down very, very quickly. Okay. It's just time saving, Ben. Yeah. Um, and when you've got to get through a lot, then you've got to take, you know, you've There's got a lot to find the quick time to do it. A lot of jaws on the floor in the comments. Uh, with Gareth, my favourite comment saying, what in the Hogwarts magic is this? <laughs> I'm so happy that you're loving them. They really are great. Now, you can use your blending brushes. You can use your blending tools if you want to. I'm being a bit naughty here and giving you a little sneak peek of something that will be coming to you very soon. Uh, okay. Oh, they're going to be on the show. Well, there you go then. Our beautiful new blending brushes are going to be on the show for you and they work brilliantly. Look at the opacity yeah, and the colour exactly that you right. get there. Take your next colour, Ben. Um, and then you're just working it in. So you're going to take it direct to the card and you can overlap. Uh -huh. So the other thing about these ink pads is the colour is layerable and they are absolutely delicious. And look, anybody can pick an ink pad up and yeah. swirl it around on a piece of white card, Ben. It makes it so, so easy to achieve these absolutely beautiful 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 results just so whilst we're watching you i've got to read a few comments there's yeah. a lot of excitement here uh, judy saying i need these ink pads oh godly hand says lindsay why oh why are you doing this to me i'm gonna to have to get myself another credit card uh, <laughs> that's from lindsay <laughs> you do what you need to lindsay no judgment here uh, we're all in the we're all in the game together. <laughs> yeah. Now look, when I use my brush and I just literally took that ink pad to the watercolor card. Look how beautiful I can get mm. that smooth ombre and finish, and really starts to look beautiful. And you can fill in your little areas. And of course, this texture showing here because it's a watercolor cardstock, not a smooth cardstock. If you do it on a smooth card you'll get a different look and feel. So you Ooh, can see incredible. that there. So you can do it on a smooth multi-purpose card okay. if you want to. You don't have to do it on the textured. Yeah. So entirely up to you. So next colour, can I just tell you quickly how to clean your brush as well? Yep. Spritzer, very light perfume waft on uh -huh. a piece of um, kitchen towel. Rub your brush on there, which means it's not wet, but what it's done is take any residue ink off. The density of the bristle holds the ink on the surface of the brush, it doesn't sink into the bristles, which means you can do that and move to another colour and blend and you won't get any contamination. Oh, perfect. So that's why they're great. Yeah. Just going to clean this away for now for a second. Move to my next colour, my third colour to ombre down here. Um, and I'm just going to go straight in with that, exactly as I did with my others. Oh, that's gorgeous. What do you call that? What's that one called? This one is called Raspberry Ripple. Raspberry Ripple. That is beautiful, Okay, so we it? just take that in there. And while it's still wet, take our brush. And notice I've used the same brush for every colour. I haven't yep. changed. I'm not getting any contamination because I just did that little clean beforehand. And we can go in and fill in the spots yeah and i won't take too much longer we'll just leave it at that because that's how you do your opaque finish amazing now we're going to add the water uh -huh. so a couple of different ways you can do it you can use your spritzer if you want to and i've put mine down somewhere so i'll find it in a second it was here it's two minutes ago like magic. it's well, like magic waft. oh it's yeah the it's probably to your right hand side you wafted it, didn't you? I wafted it and it's I gone. Doesn't it doesn't matter. Gone. I'm okay. going to use this. I'm going to do the flicking technique instead. Okay. Um, did I go on to be rocket block? No. Never mind. Um, right. So, water on the fingers. Yep. Brent, bring you a new spritzer, by the way. Oh, gone. thank you, Brent. Gorgeous here. You threw it over the other side of the studio. Thank That's you. what I happened. I threw it over there and just <laughs> Right. So, just water on my fingers uh -huh. and I'm flicking it at the card. So, you've done this before. Yeah. You've seen it happen lots of times. But what you will see now is instead of it bleaching it out, it starts to react and you get that white, chalky finish yes. starting to show itself. The longer the water is on there, the more that white chalky finish will be obvious. That's a great effect. So you can just leave it to dry yep. on its own. And it isn't bleaching that out. It's bringing the white chalk in the ink to the surface. Mm -hmm. So you can leave that to dry naturally or you can heat it with a heat tool. 
if it gets to a certain point where you think I don't want any more white mm -hmm. I'm happy with that level of white on my project and I want the reaction to stop that's when you get your heat gun out and blast it yeah and it will stop the reaction uh, with the chalky effect it will inhibit any future involvement of that chalky effect and set that design on your card okay so we've done that now while that's drying I'm going to cut to a bit that's already dry Ben because we don't want to watch that it's boring so I'm going to come to my piece that I did on smooth cardstock and take a stencil because now I want to show you how you can layer the colours over. This is bone dry. Uh -huh. It's been done for a few days, so it's nice and dry. You don't have to wait a few days. You're only going to need to wait, oh, I don't know, a couple of hours, okay. something like that. You know, just let it dry. Depends how warm your environment is. That's a bit sticky. I'm going to take a bit of that off there. I don't want it too sticky. Put my stencil on over the top, just where I would like some texture. These stencils are definitely going to be available for you. I think these are on the show as well from... I'm not the person with the expert on what's on the show. I'm not going to lie. They All know right. what's on the show. Look at the know booklet. What... Yeah, just look at the booklet. Sarah said, look in the booklet. I forgot about the booklet, Sarah. Look at the booklet. You'll find everything that's in the available booklet. there. Uh, in the booklet. <laughs> and then with your brush or your blending tool, take your ink through your stencil mm -hmm. and what you'll be able to do and if this was a harmony water reactive Ben this wouldn't work because you would get a different color with these inks they're layerable so you can layer a new color on top of a dry color underneath and still uh, see the you. new color yeah is what I'm explaining to you here so just going through the stencil just you know roughly wherever you would like it to be when you pull that up you can see the oh, effect you get is absolutely superb yeah. and we haven't been able to achieve that with any of our ink pads to date so you can layer brand new colors on top of color on top of color and get those beautiful results what you can also do is use them to stamp detail so let's say i wanted to add some little bits of texture in there i can take uh, that purple or an another color i'll just keep using the purple i've got it here and just with an acrylic stamp, I can ink that up. Uh, and these are in the booklet too, yeah. I've remembered. Uh, we can layer that up and start to bring our texture in. So you can do beautiful stamped delicate texture. And you see you can layer those colours up on top of each other. And really start to create those beautiful layered textural mixed media pieces that you would normally need three different ink pads for but you can do it with one ink pad uh, and it really does make it makes it so so easy and fabulous to do uh, do some of your silhouette stamping over the top if you want to as well yep. so i'm just going to use one of the fairies that we've got um, and she just use a i'm going to use an alcohol proof one here uh, just a few more comments coming through. Um, I, Kim says, I still have a kidney for sale. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that is extreme measures. I know there's so many great things on this show, but, you know, whatever works for you. Uh, and Kirsty says, do you really need to buy food and pay your bills? I'm sure I can save money by not doing that so I can buy everything that's being shown today. Um, there's so much love for these. Oh, no, says Lindsay. Uh, not just inks and blending brushes. Come on, guys. You are killing me. Uh, Patricia says, love these ink pads and the colours are just beautiful. Alex Ray says, these ink pads are a game changer. These are the colours. Oh, what are you doing there? I didn't notice you there. <laughs> I've been sat watching Leanne Shaw like this. Oh, yeah. yeah. You're in the VIP seat. We've both, literally both been like oh, that. the VIP seat, this is, is it? Yeah, welcome. We're in the, we're in the VIP seat. Yeah. Yeah, the, the, you don't have to do any work here. You just chit-chat in everybody's seat. Yeah, and give, <laughs> and give away uh, the Dua ink pad uh, in just a few moments' time. We're going to give those uh, away. Sorry, Leanne, back to, back to you. Absolutely no problem. So I've just stamped a fairy on there, and I've used my alcohol proof. Uh, these stamps are all definitely in the booklet. They're absolutely fantastic. So I'm just using one of the larger ones here. Here on the rocker block and I'm going to put a little bit in the corner and I think what you can see is that you're able to layer beautiful different effects now I could do black silhouettes here if I wanted to yeah or I could do them with the I'm going to do black 
and I'll tell you why. You can also faux bleach with these. So, look, every single technique yeah. you can complete with a quick dry, yes. a pigment, so and a Harmony water reactive in the past, yeah. you can complete with these. Plus, you've got that white chalk. Now, can I just bring this in? It's dry. Look, Absolutely. this is the one I did earlier. Yeah. Look at the white chalky. Incredible. Once you leave it to dry, it continues to react. The first minute you put the water on, it doesn't look, you think, well, mine's not working. Yeah. But just leave it for a couple of minutes and you start to see that beautiful reaction where that chalky effect uh, comes to the front. And the effect when you ink with these, it's a flat, black, matte and not black, a flat matte chalky effect. Yes. Because you've got that hybrid fusion of pigment dye and that textural white ink in there. These are, I feel so, like you could do the rest of the show on these, Leanne. <laughs> like, have yeah, I took yeah, too long? Wrap, wrap it up, Chip. Do you want me to stop? You're making me look bad. <laughs> OK, so uh, I'm just going to show you what else you can do with these. We're just building a little, you know, a little sample piece. Take your water on a paintbrush and to get some light in the little seed heads paint your water in leave it a couple of seconds so you can just decide these are the areas where i would like a little bit more highlight yeah in there do um, that lindsay's asking could i use these alongside things like the glitter paste my metallics absolutely all of the above yeah so do that mop that away i see i've dropped a bit of water there but never mind doesn't matter keep doing that pick it up and then what you can do finally is also watercolour with them. Yeah. I can add a different colour down there, pick it up and add that into my seed head. Incredible. So I can bring that extra colour in there. And because I'm just using the three colours that I use to blend the background, it then means that that whole thing comes together as one piece and it's just using the ink pads and all of the different ways that they've been created did i mention you could heat emboss with them ben uh you can you can or cannot? you can get out of town that's the true story you can heat emboss with them what truly the... every single technique you can do with that you can do them with and you will get the most incredible results it is the ink pad launch that i in the 13 years that I've worked for Crafters Companion, I'm the most excited about. Um, I, I, wow, I can't explain to you the excitement which is coming through on the socials. Leanne, thank you so much for popping in to see us. It was well worth uh, you coming in and just showing us all around those. Amazing, says Alex. These are a game changer. The ink pads are awesome, says Joni Palmer. Charlotte says, holy pope on a rope. Uh, this is an even bigger game changer. Leanne, you and your team are awesome. And Zoe Carver says, I reckon Harry Potter must be based at Crafters Companion. Uh, amazing Amazing product, says Jane L. Safdie, and these inks and stamps look amazing, says Sarah Crowell. Uh, we're going to give them away. We're going to give these away. Congratulations to uh, for her comment of, so looking forward to the new ink pads. I'm a sucker for ink pads. Kim on YouTube, you've won them. Congratulations, Kim. Uh, thank you for your comment. You need to message us uh, QVC prizes at crafterscompanion.co.uk and we will get those sent out to you. And don't forget, uh, if you're going to be tuning in for those, of course you are. Six o'clock hour on Wednesday to see those now very very quickly i want to show you some other items uh, we're gonna have to move on at a bit of a pace here because quite rightly we took a little bit longer showing you through uh, those amazing ink pads um the pop-up book card kit uh, these are going to absolutely marvelous if you want to make um, outstanding cards that have a really cool pop-out effect like so uh, all you got to do is get your hands on the pop out kit 496 pieces it brings you all of these different designs and you've got the ability uh, to be able to make 20 cards within this set you get all of the envelopes included too um, and the great thing is once again as with all of our card kits you'll find that you'll have a lot of the uh, toppers and decorations and sentiments left over once you've made all the cards so you can use those elsewhere as well uh, you'll be seeing these in more detail much more detail in the midnight hour uh, but if you uh, want to grab those uh, make sure you tune in uh, at midnight to see them we are going to move on at a pace um, from the pop-up book card kit to oh nesting dies we all love a nesting die uh, and wait till you see these at uh, the ornate nesting dies uh, Sarah's got them at just the other side of the studio yes they are a nesting die but a brand new concept in nesting dies for us now 
those of you who have followed Crafters Companion for years, you'll notice, especially the last few years, our nesting dies have just been the bomb.com. This is what everybody wants, okay? What we've done is we've taken this. Let's have a little look. I want to make sure I show you the I want to show you this set that's on your screen, first of all, okay? Right. So usually with a nesting die you will get an outside nest and then an inside what we've done is given you this beautiful inside detail die ben so you've got a lovely background panel to use in your card so you've yep. got a background panel then you've got a nest around the outside then first time ever we've given you corner pieces to go with it as well okay so you've got four corners you've got the frame and you've got the nest piece it's exactly the same if we go with the top of this top as this one's called this time you get that lovely oval frame in the middle you'll see these so useful on a lot of your cards and then you also get the outside piece and the corners now how we've got four different dies they're paired on qvc if you want to know how they're paired i mean i know we've shown you but you can look in the booklet and you'll see all the details absolutely okay? this next set here now you if you notice on the fact last i've shown you they were rectangular base these are square base so these are going to work on your six by six your five by five cards whereas the other ones you're working on your five by seven your four by sixes mm -hmm. this time again you get that panel so for example card like this you can see we've got that lovely panel on the inside for whatever it is you want to showcase then you've got the frame that goes with it as well okay now those edge pieces the the corners you don't have to just use this corner. look at this one here with the square but then look how they've been used around the side of oh, the yeah. box mm -hmm. isn't that a little bit different okay now this one you get the square one that also comes with that lovely kind of um, ornate oval circle in the middle as well, right? So you get this one here, always with those corner panels all working together in there. Is that one of the circle? What? Yes, look at that there. Oh, that's Doesn't incredible. Doesn't that look fabulous? Yeah. With what? So this is from our, um, you'll have all picked this up. This is from our lovely set where you do your um, sentiments. And then you've got that lovely background panel, the, cent uh, the, the secondary set, so it's always working with your uh, inside piece and outside piece to match, okay? So that is exactly what's going to be included. Now, we haven't got time to do a full demonstration. Oh, I think you'd be falling over. But I wanted you to see and get a feel for how these work, okay? So you're going to be getting, look, look at this one here. It, onto the acetate this time. There's your centerpiece and there's your outside panel. Now, to make a fabulous card, okay, what I would be uh, recommending. Yeah. So look here, what I've done is I've started, I've used some of that lovely uh, background paper that we've got. Then you can see I've just cut an aperture out the middle, but then you're going to use your outer die and you're going to cut it with the outside die frame, right? So by the time you cut that out, it's going to come out like this. And then look, we can use that around the outside. All I've done is I've cut this um, just by eye, the inside piece to give me that lovely panel on the front. Then what I've got is I've got just a nice piece of cardstock for the inside, but I've actually done it, Ben, yeah. where I've used two of the corners onto uh, this panel okay. here. So that is going to go as the inside of my card there like this, right? So you won't see them until you open it. But then actually what's going to look lovely is the inside, the main panel die, you can take and stick in the center of Useful. your card. Now, by the time you add a couple of embellishments onto here, this is what we're talking about in terms of the card, right? And having that frame, Ben, but not only the frame, the frame, but then the inside panel as well, how brilliant do these look, right? Absolutely. And remember, go and have a little look in the booklet. Not only will you see all of the options and how they come together, but you'll also see how we've paired them and you'll see samples of what our designers have made with each one of the four dies in the collection. These are coming up in the nine o'clock, so it's one of our big launches. So this is coming up straight after the TSV launch in the launch hour of the whole event. Yeah, so make sure you're watching. Um, in case uh, you might be new to QVC, Freeview Channel 16. If you're on Sky, it's 660, free sat Channel 800. Or of course, if you want to watch online, you can. Uh, QVCUK.com uh, is where you need to be watching. Nine o'clock Tuesday uh, and then from midnight Wednesday right throughout the day uh, you will not want to miss all of the shows loads of love for the nesting dies coming through I do love those nesting dies I'm loving the new concept says Lindsay uh, can't have enough nesting dies says Sandra Biggs uh, and Alison Jarrett says these are so much more than nesting dies and I love them uh, we're going to give them away and we are going to give them away to uh, a lady who said I need so beautiful and we all know you can never have too many nesting dies well done to uh, Bethan Lyon on Facebook congratulations Bethan uh, those are yours. You just need to message us to claim your prize. Uh, need your address details, obviously. Uh, QVC prizes. 
at craftiscompanion.co.uk. Yes, getting the hang of this now. Uh, right, very quickly, let's show you some other goodies that you will definitely want to get your hands on. Our insert pads, uh, you'll be able to see these in the midnight hour. Two booklets, um, and what you're going to get is a gold foil booklet and also a silver foiled uh, booklet. Um, I love that, Nicola. All, all, all the thoughts taken out of the middle of your card, but actually not just for uh, the middle of your card, as I will try and show you in the one minute I've been allotted here that a lot of these you're going to use as main focal points on the front of your card as well and we cover off in here this is just the silver booklet you've got it replicated in the gold as well you've got it on white you've got it on cream in these booklets too and you've got lots of beautiful verses which I think would be great for the inside of your cards and you've also got lots of kind of um, shorter comments and sentiments as well uh, for the outside got that in silver and in gold and look as I was saying not just for your um, card inserts you can snip into these you can use, use these for home decor projects yes you can use these on the front of your cards yes of course you can also use these to decorate things like your party bags as well they're super versatile uh, they are really really beautiful with all that foiling in and of course uh, you can pick them up uh, in the midnight hour if you want to see more about those and you want to see more inspiration what do you need to do Look at the booklet, Nicola, you got it. Uh, it. The link is there where you're watching this right now. You can download it, you can have a peruse and a browse and see all of the amazing items that we've got coming up for you um, this coming week. Talking about amazing items, let's get back to Sarah for our next amazing product. Uh, we're gonna look at this beautiful uh, die cut 3D topper pad, Sarah. Yes, I'm expecting these being ridiculously popular when they launch, okay? We have absolutely... Now, we've had decoupage topper pads on QVC in the past, complete sellout, and there's not many items where I can tell you are a complete sellout when we've launched them. This was one of them, okay? So if you love to do 3D work like this, Ben, right? Whether yeah. it's on a scrapbook page like this, maybe you have lovely floral panels that go around the front of a card, maybe it is the central focal piece of a card like this, or... Maybe if you want to go next level and you want to use a couple of them on the front of a card, that is what you can be doing with Ooh, some of God. these designs. Okay, now, we've got fancy florals uh -huh. and we've got our everyday celebration, but it's not a choice of, because you get fancy florals and every... No, you're not going there. And everyday celebration <laughs> yep. in the collection that you're getting. Okay, you can just go around the corner out the way as well. Yes, there you are. Right, so, two die-cut topper pads, okay? Now, you can see it shows you on the back these are all of the designs that you get. So each one's got three different pages and you get multiple sheets of each page. So there's three designs, five sheets of each. And you can see there, there's your florals. And then there are your, uh, what do you call them? Everyday celebrations. Okay? Yeah. So you get multiples of each one. We're also including your 3D glue gel. So you'll see me putting these together with 3D glue gel. Now I will show you all the designs in a second. What I wanted to show you is how these work, okay? Okay. So what you would do is if I go, let's open this first set, right? And we want to do the beautiful balloons. So what we're doing is we're die cutting, we're popping out because they're already pre-die cut. Layer one, then we're gonna go and do exactly the same with layer two on here. We're gonna do the same with layer three, uh -huh. layer four on there. And then if you want to layer all these together, what you're gonna do, we're gonna take our base design, second layer, and we're gonna just shape them a little bit. If you want to, you don't have to, but I love the designs when they're shaped like this. We're gonna take our 3D glue gel, which I've just um, decanted I think that's the right word, yeah. Yeah, good Decanted word. Decanted into the, um, the syringe which comes included. That will then pop on the top of here. So there's my second layer, okay? Going to do the same with the third layer. So again, I'm just using the, um, the shaping tool. You, you don't have to shape this. This is if I just want to make it look three-dimensional. And again, a couple of nice big globules of glue. Yeah. That will shape exactly onto the front of here. Now you're talking, you see, we're starting to get yeah. really dimensional like this. And then the last one, just a little bit of shaping on here like this. And then I'm going to add that on. And we've got a lovely panel and piece ready to go straight under the front of a card. Now, that you're going to leave to dry, right? So you can see there just how thick and oh yes you can just how thick and dimensional that Absolutely. is yet you can't see any of the glue inside that's all being held being kept 3d right i've done a nice quick simple card here 
whereby what I've done is I've used those lovely brand new duet ink pads to create like a nice chalky background with some um, lovely pieces on here, right? Yep. That is going to go on the front of there, right? You can add your little uh, with love on here as well if you want. Bear in mind, you've got multiple ones of these, so you might want to take this little, leave a little extra piece on the bottom, oh, maybe, yeah. right? And then on the inside, just to finish it all off, use one of those lovely verse inserts to go with it so i've actually got my one here where i've stuck everything down because i'm still waiting for that to dry okay look how professional this looks where well, you've got your lovely card but then we've got That's that lovely great. verse on the inside enjoy your very special day happy birthday nice and fun uh, them them inserts by the way ben yeah. i know they're in the midnight hour uh, i would suggest as soon as they go live on the website get them ordered because i do not think they will make it to the end of the midnight hour so okay. if you're waiting to get if you're thinking oh i'll just order it the next morning when they're ready i don't think they'll still be there don't say i didn't warn you Tips from the top there, you see. Tips from the top. Uh, fabulous booklet, says Kate Watson. Downloaded, really inspired. And Lindsay says, love those inserts. Just finishes off cards and boxes. Uh, I would even use them for home decor, as we showed you. They're perfect. Love topper pads, says Cara. They look lovely and definitely going to try and get those. Topper pads are, uh, topper pads are fab. Topper pads. Topper pads are fab. That's not easy to say. Why do I keep saying it? Uh, says Kim. Uh, for quick makes to restart your mojo. They are absolutely perfect for quick makes. Uh, Lindsay Travasky says, I love, love, love. 3D topper pads. Oh my daddy lord, I shouldn't have clicked on this. Way too many new toys. Uh, there's more to come as well. Uh, and Chad says, uh, this is perfect to get my friend into decoupage. Simple yet amazing. Yeah, they're absolute game changers and brilliant to get uh, new people into craft as well. Let's give them away. The 3D die cut topper pads are going to go to Lindsay Travaskis. Congratulations. You said you love them. Uh, well, you've got them now, Lindsay. Congratulations. Uh, you just need to message us. Uh, QVC prizes at crafterscompanion.co.uk. And yes, Lindsay, to quote you, oh my daddy lord, you've just got them you've just got them uh, very very quickly want to show you something which is also going to be coming up uh, in the 9 p.m hour on wednesday um, a dye discovery bag so this again is absolutely perfect for you maybe you are fairly new to um crafting uh, maybe you're fairly new to these uh, craft days on qvc and you're wanting a lovely selection of um dyes to kind of get you going well this is a great little bag that you can pick up because we've got a little bit of everything here uh, from edgeable technology so you've got that beautiful bonnie bow in there that looks absolutely gorgeous uh, if you want to do a bit of coloring a bit of paper piecing that's going to be in your dye discovery bag we then also got some of our uh, beautiful um, image sentiments or saying dies these again absolutely perfect uh, two dies you get the one with that beautiful saying so they're friends they're a family and there are friends that become family and then you get the outer die there as well so you can layer that one up to create beautiful panels just like that. Creator cards in here, of course, as well. So if we're going to give you a die discovery bag, uh, we've got to give you some of our creator cards because these are fantastic. Um, and again, this one's amazing because this one is actually stuck on the inside of the card, but you get that other die cut piece there, which you can actually hang uh, from the outside of your card to create like a twirling effect. So that looks amazing. Uh, we've then also got, uh, I love these dies so much um, because what you've got here is the ability almost to like build up your own little sentiment. These dies are great if you've got like a little um, sort of scrap box with lots of offcuts of cardstock that you can build up these beautiful sentiments with. So you make my heart happy. This is an amazing bag, isn't it, right? You've got uh, Cascading Butterfly Edgeables in here. Uh, you've also got more of those image sentiment dies. So this one here, uh, this will be me on Sunday. Uh, it's time to celebrate with cake loads of cake once again those are nice and easy to create really really stunning sentiments with uh you've got uh the nesting dies in here too so your scallop rectangle nesting frames i think this card here really beautifully shows uh just the kind of things that you can create with those with all those different frames in there loads of depth and loads of dimension you've got beautiful um edgeables in here too the grande swirl dies these look great when you cut them on their own but then once you sort of cut them in the edge and then piece them back in in different color cards that they look amazing and talking of edgeables you've got the just for you in there too so it's a bumper bag as you can see dies discovery bag because you get a little bit of everything as far as our dies are concerned if you like the look of that you can see it in more detail in the booklet and in the nine o'clock hour on wednesday and uh, talking of edgeables uh, sarah has got some grande edgeables to show you just over there 
Yes, every time I have edibles on QVC, these are incredibly popular. They, they, do you know, ev nearly every edible set that we had has sold out, Ben. Yeah. And this is the winning that gets everybody talking. So I think it's a brilliant way if you want to do quite advanced die cutting, but you want to achieve that look really quick and simply, right? So an edible die, this is how it works, okay? It has got a cutting line on the outside edge but then it doesn't cut it, it doesn't cut completely out. It's not a border, it just cuts on the edge. Okay? Yeah. So for example, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this card here, and these are super thick dies, which means you can cut through multiple layers. So for example, if I put that on the end of my card like this, right? And I take that and run that through my Gemini now, what you'll find is, let me just imagine I've done that with here. So can you see, this is the one, there it is. I've done that exact same thing with, I put that on the edge of the card, yep. I ran it through the machine. As it's come off, it cuts me the front and it can also cut the inside oh, of the card. So you get that edge design on the front and the inside. And actually that one there, look how simple and easy the card is now. Yeah. All I've done is added a little bit of paper at the front. That looks fabulous because you've got the die cutting onto the front and the inside. Now, if I show you the four designs, right, the four designs in the collection. So we've got the, the lovely one here that's got the floral. So this is the die. Again, you can see that outside cutting edge and all this detail cut in so that you can see it kind of gives you this sort of effect as it was right and then the flowers the little petals of all of these flowers do oh, lift up out. as you get into there don't they look fabulous yeah. right so you get the little ditty floral one this is my favorite not oh. that we have favorites but i absolutely love this Balloon. one i love the edge piece on here and let me just show you one card so exactly the same design as what you're seeing look at this so cut into the front and cut into the inside That's incredible shadowed in pink on the front there and you just see if i put that against my white top you'll see looks like it's got a little bit of shadow coming yeah out. how fabulous is that and then the same design on that one into a gatefold card where you've got the gatefold i've got it upside down here but you've got the gatefold and it cuts on both edges isn't that fabulous? And again, just a little bit of silver, slightly offset, and then it just catches the Ooh, light. Imagine yeah. that with the insert pad piece on there as well, but wouldn't that be lovely, yeah. right? Now, second one. Then you've got this one here as your third one. So this is where you've got like your floral vines coming in there. Mm -hmm. And then the fourth one in the set is the one that you just saw me using, right? Now, again, just to give you a few ideas of how you might want to be using these, what about using, like say you've gone for the new uh, card pads that we've got, oh, right? yes. uh, the packs of cards. What about taking one of your cards and cutting into the front of the card? So that one there, you're cutting right into the front. And now, this is not one of those ones, but it just shows you how you could do it in any shape card. That's a good you shot, might want yeah. to cut into the front panel of the card. Yeah. Or, I like a good tenfold card. Tenfold card where we've just cut, instead of cutting on the front and the inside, just cut on the inside now. They always look good if you notice nearly every one of these cards though has been shadowed with the second piece behind it, yeah. right? Now they will work multi-dimensionally, so you can go up or you can go down with them. So this time we've done one cutting down on one side, flipped it round and had it popping up on the other side. Gives that lovely background panel piece. Uh, or take the card that I showed you at the very, very start of the, sh the uh, presentation, but this time we've cut through the front and the inside. That's so good. But we've cut all so this one here, you saw I just cut on the on one side, yep. right? This one here is a tent, oh, it could actually go that way, couldn't it? Tent fold, but you'll see if I just show it to the front, tent fold and we've cut through one side and the other. And then that hasn't even been shadowed, it's just got a little bit of shaping on like that. How quick and easy was that to do? Just shows you how beautiful these designs are. Now, it's a four part piece, this one. So you get all four of those dies in the collection. And you yep. know what I'm gonna say again, Ben? Mm -hmm. Go and look in the booklet. Oh, the booklet. And you'll see some nice sample cards, ideas that you could be making with all four of the designs in that collection. They're really beautiful. And these will be on in the midnight hours, straight after the TSB launch. Yeah, if you have just joined us as well, the booklet really is the way to go. Everything is in there for you. Uh, you've got all of the details that you need as far as uh, when the shows are. Also, don't forget as well, on the uh, Facebook page, you can join our fans of Crafters Companion on QVC Group. So it's always nice to kind of share your comments and thoughts and ideas. Um, details, there you go, bottom of your screen there as to the, uh, the group that you can join. Um, and don't forget, Tuesday night is the launch of the... Um, 
the brand new Gemini 2. By the way, if you have just joined that, uh, us, keep commenting, keep sending in your uh, wish lists, ask those questions because at the end of the show, we are going to be giving that away to somebody. Nicola, you can't win, producer Nicola. You can keep saying, I want it, I want it, as many times as you want, but you can't win. Everyone else who's watching, you can win. Uh, lots of love for those edibles as well. Sandra says, who doesn't love an edible die? I love using edibles, says Charlotte. Uh, and these are nice to work with they make a difference and a wow factor for your cars and they're easy to work with as well that's the thing isn't it but they create that wow factor uh i need some grande edibles right now oh sorry lillian says i need some grande edibles right now i've not got around to eating today <laughs> those are edibles though for car making don't eat them lillian definitely uh, Gigi Freitas says, I love, love, love those Grande Edibles. Uh, June Woodhouse, beautiful samples. Uh, so versatile, says Sandra Biggs. Uh, and Alex Ray says, the design team examples are absolutely stunning. And do you know what, Alex? Uh, you've won them. Congratulations, you've been selected at random uh, for your comment of so simple yet so effective. Love these. Well, they are coming your way. Uh, just send us a message and your details, address details, of course, to QBC Prizes at craftiscompanion.co.uk and we will get those sent out to you. And keep commenting, everybody. Let us know what you're looking forward to on uh, Wednesday. Let us know what's on your wish list. What are you going to be uh, waiting for? Uh, don't, don't put, I mean, do put everything if you want to, but I want to know specifically, like, what, what's your number one? What's your number two what's your number three uh nicola if i have to tell you again i'm going to come in that gallery you can't win uh everyone else here in with the shout now also coming up in the midnight hour wednesday morning the uh, spectrum noir metallic marker and uh, pen collection pen and pencils you're going to get here um, and if you love to create that beautiful uh metallic effect then this is a beautiful set to go for these are the pencils that you're going to be getting here um top notch artist quality pencils that give you uh, that metallic sheen, that metallic shine. Um, and alongside that, actually, I'll show you in just a few seconds, you are going to get the flip markers, which are amazing. So you get all of the colours that you're seeing here. Um, and again, what we do within this bundle, which is quite nice, because these are most effective, right, when you're using these on your darker cardstock. So within the bundle itself, we are also throwing in uh, the um, the premium black paper pad, 9 by 12 um, Yes, and it is black all the way through, no white core, uh, which is fantastic. The perfect partner to go with the pencils. And alongside that, the thing that I'm most excited about, um, you're going to get a set of our metallic flip markers as well. These are the Cosmic Wonders. I'll show you these. You'll see these better on boards, and I'll show you a few cards. I don't know how these work, and I don't really care. But what happens is it, it, well, it is magic, and it's not magic, Liam. Uh, but look, what you can get with these, you see, is with one kind of flick of the light, you get one color, and another kind of catch of the light, you get a different color. These are incredible. You've got your comet, your nebula, you've got eclipse and lunar you've got galaxy and then the cosmos here as well and i hope you can just see i picked a few cards here which i think show these off really well i'm hopefully uh, you can pick these up on camera this rose here has been done with the metallic flip markers if i just give that a little Whoa, look at yeah. that that shows these off in the best light, I think. And as I say, I don't know how they work. All I know is that they do work and they look the absolute business. There's one more here as well with these Christmas trees. Let's see if I can get this one as well going with these beautiful Christmas trees. Ready? Whoa, look at that, how they change color. Um, yeah, the border glistens, the tree glistens. Oh, I could just sit here and flip this for the rest of the afternoon, but I'm not allowed. Uh, but these are covered up in the midnight hour. So you get the pencils, you get the uh, the flip markers in the Cosmic Wonder, and you get that uh, uh, bundle of um, cards included in there too. Um, it's a marvelous set. And once again, you can uh, find out more details about this in the booklet. Uh, loads of love still coming through. Uh, Sarah Lee Gressley says, oh goodness, I've just looked through the booklet. I need to win the lottery. Uh, what night is it? It's Wednesday. Lottery night tonight. Lottery night tonight. So maybe you could buy it. Are they still a pound now? I don't know if they're probably... Oh, is it two quid though? Is it shows how long since I've done it? Um, or speak to somebody nicely, maybe, Sarah. Uh, Helen Regan says, those metallics look fab. Uh, that might go on the shopping list. I reckon you're going to get them. If you like the bling, if you like the sparkle, the sheen and the shine, Nicola loves it. So she's going to be putting those on. No, you're not getting a Gemini. Uh, and Kate Watson says... Um, 
The seize the day in the auto ships is at the top of my wish list. Yeah, Sarah was saying that was going to be very, very popular. A lot of you chatting about that in the comments, actually. Uh, and Susie says, this booklet is just like choosing things for Christmas. I've ticked them all. I know it's difficult, isn't it, to pick your, uh, your top three. Let us know in the comments, though. What's your one? What's your two? What's your three? Uh, and we'll see how many people kind of, you know, agree on their favourite. Th I think I know what's going to be at number one. Uh, B Mummy just saying, the Gemini 2 and the auto ship is at the top of my list. I have a feeling that will be at the top of most people's list. Uh, and Kate McQueen says, hello, Kate, says, let's be honest, it's probably easier to tell you what is not on my list. Uh, but number two behind the G2, oh, I like that, G2, Gemini 2, obviously, uh, is the Bohemian Collection. Ooh, funny you should mention that. Uh, might be coming on to that in just a little while. Uh, as we've said, if you want to get ahead, if you're a little bit impatient and want to see what we're going to be showing you before we get uh, to it, you can, of course, get to the booklet. Um, Sarah Drabble on YouTube, hello, Sarah, says the Mediterranean Dreams collection is definitely on my wishes. I really love that. I love the designs. I love the colours. I love the paper. For me, when we were just having a little bit of a look back uh, through that earlier on, I felt like I was on holiday. Just for those five minutes where Sarah was showing us through the cards and through the paper, I just, I just felt like I was somewhere in the med um, so that was wonderful uh, um, by the way by the way uh, if you do want to go back and see what we've already covered you'll be able to watch uh, this show back as well later uh, Lillian says I think I need the Gemini 2 and then those new ink pads weren't they phenomenal with uh, Leanne and Gareth says I just told my other half that it looks like uh, they need to do lots of overtime uh, I, I need to do lots of overtime because of Sarah and Ben apologies apologies for that uh, and Joe Woodworth says so many new products that I need keep those messages coming through let us know what you're most excited excited for and remember the more you keep commenting the more you've got uh, a chance of winning I've got more goodies to give away and of course somebody at the end of the show you've got to keep watching though one of you is going to win the Gemini to uh, make sure you keep those comments coming through right enough chat from me let's get on over back to Sarah uh, and we're going to have a look at some very handy craft room tools at uh, corner punches Sarah we are indeed and you know that's one of the things I'm hearing them comment it's kind of like a bit of sweet it's a it's brilliant that we get to see everything on one day yeah. but then it's all also pretty dangerous so you are seeing all of our launches for all of May you get to get them all on that one day so usually in the UK we drip feed them a little bit every week on QVC on HSN they do one craft day and that's all of it they kind of try and make HSN way of doing things just for me just because it's National uh, Scrapbooking Month in May ah. so what we do it's National Scrapbooking Day on the 5th of May so they've put the day as close as they can get it to the third because the midweek they have their shows uh, on a Wednesday well obviously launched the Gemini 2 as the uh, TSV at, at nine o'clock on the night before run all the way through the next day until wrapping it up at uh, nine o'clock the next night now these corner punches they're coming up in the three o'clock show you are gonna love them okay and I mean absolutely love them so let me just get I'm just gonna get a, a, a piece of cardstock here right if I just show you this is just our regular rounded punch right so what I'm gonna do is you've got different sizes we just go into the edge and we just literally press down and instead of having a straight edge you then have a rounded edge on any one of your corners right and what you'll see is you've got different sizes so you've got a, an r7 an r4 or an r10 so i can have different kind of layers different styles different sizes of your corner rounded oh go right in there and you'll have the kind of different feel so this is a less rounded edge that we've got there as we go around each one but how much more professional do the corners on your cards look when they've been rounded, right? So this is a straight edge. Oh, yeah, this amazing. is giving you that lovely rounded edge. Yeah. This is giving you that lovely rounded edge on the front. Isn't that fantastic, mm. right? Or what about this one here, multi-layer card? Even just your mats and layers in the background here, how wonderful do they look when the corners are rounded, right? Now, we don't just have the corner rounder. This is the one that is your corner rounder. So if I show you the different sizes, can you see we've got, and it's basically the smaller you go, the less rounded it is. So you can see it's just a small rounding, a medium. So this is your R4, your R7, and your R10. It's just a, it's just a millimeter of roundness. Yeah. Then we start to get into our fancy ones. So for example, these are your hearts, right? So I'm gonna take this one now, and I'm going to go right into the corner, right? It's just worth me taking my time on this. And look at that now. When I take that 
and I used that one oh, into the, how fabulous and how easy was this Ben yeah just rounding my corner but it looks lovely when you've got them line you don't have to line dies up no worries it's just a punch straight on there right so that is your gorgeous heart one right that is the die set that we've got there now you've got four sets in here right okay. so you've got the heart one of the ones that I love is if you want to do photo corners right so oh, this one here idea. is your photo corner yeah so again I'm just going to take a small piece uh -huh. I'm going to go into the edges and it does you the kind of interior cut panel like this so that then when I take a photo your photo just goes you either go under the first one look at this under all four of these how incredible does that look when we line that up underneath That's here. That's brilliant. That's wonderful, right? So I just think, and do you know if you've got the first craft club as well? Yeah. These will go beautiful. So that is your photo corner piece. It gives you a lovely kind of effect on the side, or you can use it to piece your front pieces in. We also have this one here, which is like a scalloped finish, which is this one there. Yeah. And then you also have like an, an inverted scallop as it was, which is this one here. So those are all your different pieces. And just to give you an idea, few ideas of what you're going to be doing with these, okay? Look at this one here. How nice is this little project? When we open this up, you've got the nice rounded pieces with your heart. And actually, it's all ready to go to add all of your own photographs into here. What a lovely gift to give somebody, nice. right? Or use that photo edge of one. Maybe it's not for your photos. How great does that look for decoration? Then you put your papers behind in there. Yeah. Or start and use your fancy scalloped edge ones just to add, whether it's onto, it's like having a nesting die without having a nesting die bed. You're just gonna <laughs> yeah. cut this and just, you're just gonna punch the edges, but then look, you've matched it with the papers in the background. Corner punches are genius. They are simple, they are quick and easy. We've got a pack of all five, all the five that you've just seen. So just to remind you what they're gonna be, right? You're gonna do your straight, well, just your, your standard rounded one, okay? You're gonna do that lovely, what I call the photo corner one. Then you've got the lovely hearts on that one you're going to have your two different types of scallops so I call this like a, a pointy scallop and then this one's more like a fan scallop on there as well all five of those all together in one bundle coming up in the three o'clock show and I am anticipate this will be really really popular at three o'clock yeah, I do a lot of chat about those um, corner punches, actually. And Sarah Krause says, I've never used punches before, but the effect of them is amazing. Got a funny feeling you'll be picking those up uh, in the three o'clock hour they're coming your way. OMG, says Anne-Marie Holmes. Those corner punches are a game changer and also a space saver, so I can buy more stash as it's saving me space. I'm liking your thinking. That's the kind of thinking that we need. I'm liking that a lot. Uh, result, well done on these. Yippee, says Anne-Marie. Uh, June Hines says, OMG, so much to choose from. But I'm loving the new Gemini 2. I love Crafter's Companion. Uh, and Helen Regan says, oh poo. Now, that's what she says. Oh poo, now I want the corner punches too. Oh my word. Just make little lists, you know, little wish lists. It was a good little rhyme actually. Oh poo, now I want the corner punches too. Uh, Angela Brown says, and the Gemini 2, not a number two. Angela says, um, her top three, Gemini 2, ink pads, auto ship. Uh, Lily of the Valley's top three, yeah, here we go. Gemini 2, nesting dies, Mediterranean collection. Can't wait to get all of those. And Hannah Gosling Smith, hello Hannah. Uh, how's Kiri today? Um, after the Gemini 2, the auto ship, and then the ink pads uh, is in your uh, top list as well and Chaz Aston says uh, the Gemini the magnetic storage stand uh, the true love collection and the auto ship etc etc basically nearly all of them uh, says Chaz um, right let's move on uh, to have a look at oh yes the jigsaw it's me isn't it sorry I'm so busy oh I've got to give them away sorry I've got to give them away first I've not even given them away. I've got so many jobs to do over here in VIP Corner. I just can't keep track of everything. There's the comments, reminding people. I know, John, there's so much, so much to do. Sorry, I'm being told off now because I'm rubbing on too much. Uh, the corner punches, we're going to give those away. Yes, Kate McQueen, you've been selected at random to win the corner punches. Um, so well done, Kate. Uh, you know what to do by now. Send us a little email with your details, your address to uh, QVC Prizes at craftingscompanion.co.uk. Uh, quick one from me, uh, jigsaw dies. These are fantastic. And I love the fact that we bundled up um, 
your standard jigsaw and then the abstract jigsaw die in here too so uh, you've got the ability to make a uh, 30 piece and 24 piece jigsaws too um, and not of course just with your cardstock because these are multimedia dies so you can create um, and cut through a whole range of different materials as well so that's your five but yeah it's you know things like your fabric your cork of course your mount board which we are including within this bundle as well um, so you've got your five by seven um, standard jigsaw die and then you've also got it in the same size in that abstract effect we also pop into the bundle uh, your mount board of course which is going to allow you to create those um, really professional uh, jigsaws the kind of the ones that you buy in the shops you've now got the ability to create these at home so it's a lovely bundle to go with and whilst I always think of these as yes absolutely what you can do is create um, as we see here a beautiful little card box where you create um, you know the picture on the outside at the jigsaw puzzle and then create a little box to go on the inside and then you've got the jigsaw to make in there too which I think is super duper clever but it allows you to print off all your pictures this is a great excuse if you are one of those people who takes loads and loads of pictures and then you never know what to do with them this is a great excuse to be able to do it and, and do you know what another thing I think about these and I, I always think about um, uh, Sarah and the, and the boys whenever these come up um, this is not an example, but I'm just showing you a few more cards. If you have got kids or grandkids and they like to uh, do their drawings and make their own pictures and whatnot, what a great opportunity to be able to turn their creations, their drawings, their pictures, into jigsaws. I just think that's such a lovely thing to do. And imagine surprising them with that and then getting them to put together uh, their own pictures, their own drawings in jigsaw style. I absolutely love these. And I think it's a great bundle. So you get both of those five by seven multimedia jigsaw dies and the bundle of mount board included in there too. Uh, you'll see those in the three o'clock hour on Wednesday, but don't forget more inspiration, more hints and tips and details uh, about those in the booklet, which of course you've, yes, I know you've already, you've already downloaded it. If you haven't, you'll find the link uh, where you're watching us right now. Lots of people chatting to me in the comments about the uh, Bohemian collection. That is fast approaching. You're going to have to hang on a little while for that, but we'll be showing it to you uh, very, very shortly indeed. But let's get on to, I think, uh, one of the most amazing things uh, that we've had here at Crafters Companion in recent time. Uh, these super duper shimmer ink pads, Sarah. Yes, so you've seen Leanne presenting our new duet ink pads. These are our incredible shimmering pads. So these are back in stock after months and months we've been waiting to get them back in at QVC. And I'm sure when you see what these do, you will absolutely love it. So let me just show you a few sort of things that you're going to be using these ink pads for, okay? Look at this one here so on this one we've used them to stamp and you can heat emboss with this if you want we've used them to paint with and look how you've got that shimmer and it beautifully catches the light but then also look in the background here 3d embossing and they've actually been dragged over the embossing powder uh, over the embossed panel yeah. same here where we've just done lovely um washes and background pieces this is one of the, i've loved i've done this card done this one in the past before it's lovely how you can do these lovely mottled effect backgrounds you can also stamp and drag the colors out or you can create your own background pieces now i'm going to show you how to do that i'm going to show you how to do a couple of different techniques actually and then we're going i'm going to show you all the well actually let me just show you all the colors that come with them first right so these are all of the colors that we have in the collection and we have the details if you go and look in the booklet you can see all of the shimmer ink pads that we have so you can see all the different colors there now i'm going to use a bit of queen bee and some peach rose all right so i've got a little bit of watercolor card here here's my peach rose and then let me get a little bit of queen bee in there so this is my nice yellow and then also my peach my raspberry now i'm working onto a glass mat ben yeah. which means i can put some of that color down straight onto the mat look how vibrant Ooh, look yeah. how intensely pigmented this is yeah. and then i'm just using it this is just water guys just using a little bit of water to wet all over the background here all right and i'm going to pick up some of this color and i'm just going to paint with this one look how intensive that color is straight onto the background right now what you'll find is the wetter your cardstock the more it will water down the intensity of that color so if i want to pick up just going to pick up more of this and i'm going to actually do a second layer over there so that we don't lose any of that gorgeous shimmer and sparkle as we're going down right so there's my first color yeah and i'm going to wash that in to the peach rose just as intense just as vibrant going to pick up a little bit of that color here and again just water coloring into the background and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to blend my peach and um, i'm just going to get plenty of color down here yep when i've got the color down 
I'm going to blend the peach into the new colour shade that we've got there in the yellow, right? Which is which was Queen Bee. And I'm just using a wet brush to blend the two together, right? Now, once you leave this to dry, right? And I, I'm, I've got one here that I've actually left to dry. Yeah. Look at it. Let me show you to the close-up camera, first of all, right? So this is when it's wet. And you can start to see, as it's drying, we're starting to see some of that shimmer. Soon as it's completely dry... There's the one here. Look at the sh look at the way it catches the light. Ooh, that is incredible. your shimmering pad there, right? So beautiful. Now, what you can do is not only this. Let me just get a little bit of Mediterranean um, dreams. You can use that with, can you? Those colours would work fabulous with the Mediterranean dreams, mm. right? I'm just going to get a little bit here. Clean up as I'm going, so I don't get the background piece here. Let's use this one. Now, I want to show you how we can stamp with it, right? So I'm going to just get my stamp and um, background here, and I'm going to. It might rock or block it up, right? So I've got one of my stamps here. Pop the stamp on, and then you can just use these as you would a regular ink pad, but they've got that incredible sheen going on with them, right? So I'm going to stamp, let's stamp it over the colour here. So I'm going to do first stamp, and then I'm going to get a shadow stamp going on, and I'm going to get a shadow stamp going on there. Oh, wow. And then we can come in with a second, oh, let's get the leaf on here too leaf coming on so i'm creating my own background here. I'm just showing you how they're brilliant to stamp with and also brilliant to do that water coloring effect with look at these i'm starting to put all these together create beautiful backgrounds and the shimmer you can see the shimmer in there can't you yeah haven't lost any of that shimmer now whether you're water coloring with them look i've actually used the die cut and stamp to match here water color yes you can see that shimmer and as I took, look at this now, yes. Oh, there we go. Right. And actually, I want to show you, I've done some of the leaves as well. How fabulous do they look, mixing the different colours together. And I know I haven't had a chance to do a full card, but you can go and watch full presentations of these on the, um, if you go onto YouTube and just search for our shimmering pads, you can see loads of our craft presenters doing different demonstrations. Yeah. Look at the backgrounds, but I wanted to show you a couple of the techniques that you can do with these right now i'll be featuring these in the three o'clock show you'll be able to watch and learn a little bit more about them so there's a lovely background wash that we've got here all right then i've done a um, bit of four bleaching Ooh, where i've done, done a background effect. wash and then pulled the color out like leanne did with the other ones yeah this is dropping the wet color onto um a, onto your paper spritzing it so that you get that lovely mottled effect but can you see the shimmer coming through there you can use these through stencils and do background blended uh, letterpress Love technique where we put it inside your embossing folder here Little, uh, adding the salt on and the salt drags out the color blending it over top of your embossed panels on there stamping and dragging out a little bit of color with your stamp piece and there are honestly loads and loads of different techniques that you can do that's what's spritzing when we stamp them go and have a little look go onto youtube and search shimmering pads you'll see all the techniques that we do with them but they will be available we will be featuring it in the three o'clock show there's so much you can do with them that's one of the ones i'm really looking forward to presenting yeah, loads of love still coming up, for, uh, coming in for these. Love the shimmer inks. I've been painting with mine today, says Kim. Uh, Joe says the other half has just gone home, so trying not to let him see my wish list. Ha ha. Or maybe you should let him see your wish list and, you know, give it a little bit of a nudge. Uh, these shimmer ink pads are absolutely stunning, says Charlotte. If you don't already have them, you need them. Uh, and Samantha Lee says, my favourite Spectrum Noir shimmer ink pads. Uh, hedgehog shaped, yes, hedgehog shaped indeed. Uh, Gareth says, those shimmer ink pads were the best thing that I've bought in a long, long time. Um, and Susie, our Susie, just backing everyone up here, seeing these totally live up to the hype. Patricia Bing says, OMG, that shimmer. I know, right? Uh, and Lindsay says, oh, Sarah, I could just kidnap you just so I could learn from you hands on. Well, you can take me. Sorry, I'm talking on my, I've got my microphone on. Right? Um, oh, we're, we're all good to go. Uh, you, you can kind of take me with you. So I'm, yeah. I'm on YouTube all the time. Yeah. Like, go on, search me. You, you'll see loads, even me doing loads of techniques with them shimmering pads, loads on YouTube. Go and have a little look. Absolutely right. Um, and Alex Racing, love the example book crafting goals yes absolutely uh, we will uh, very shortly give away those shimmer ink pads but before we do um let me show you um some storage because no doubt you're buying lots of new goodies right um and you're getting very excited for uh the qvc show so uh, you're going to need more storage uh, we've got that with our new easy to store zip and store um uh, cases these are incredible you're going to get two of the squares and you're going to get two of the rectangles as well and um, if you love your um storage 
Lloyds. These are slightly different maybe to things like the Totally Tiffany um, bags that you've seen before, the buddy bags. You've got zippers all the way around these as opposed to your um, hook and loop or your Velcro. Uh, but once again, the things that you love about these, uh, they're see-through so you know exactly what is in them. Um, they are white clean for you as well. And the thing I love about these two, uh, yes, exactly right, Liam. A firm bottom. Um, we all love a firm bottom, don't we? Um, so again, you know, you can uh, make sure that the items in here are going to stay nicely, beautifully stored. I always think this one um, would work quite nicely for things like your phone pads. You could um, layer those in there and have those to dispense nice and quickly. Uh, as always, you've got your handle on there, nice and easy to carry, nice and easy to store on the shelf. The bigger one, I mean, it's up to you whatever you want to store in these, but as you can see in ours, we've just thrown in a load of stuff. We've got some pens in there, we've got some sponges some gesso some uh, spritzes and there's tons more room in there as well you can see the amount of stuff that we've got in but there's plenty more room in there uh, to pop in more goodies two squares you've got you're then also going to get the two rectangles the smaller rectangle case um, I think is absolutely perfect as we've shown you here for storing in your ink pads and actually on uh, previous shows we've shown that you can get um, full collections in there like the full collection of your quick dries or your um, your water reactives they'll stack in there nice and easily once again Again, handles either side so it might make it nice and easy to take off the shelf carry with you and if you do have like the lids do come off and you know you get any ink on there you can wipe those clean and then you've got the large one as well uh, which again you can well just carry a whole host of different items in these uh, you get all four within the bundle which is incredible um, and if you want more ideas want to see these in more detail it is all in the booklet for you these will be coming up on Wednesday at 3 p.m. Uh, so do make sure you tune in to find out more about them right i think i need to give away the uh ink pads and i'm going to give them away to for a comment on facebook of ooh, the shimmer ink pads are amazing sarah kral congratulations sarah you've won the shimmer ink pads uh, you know what to do by now <laughs> i love how all of our team are trying to win the prizes we've got nicola trying to win the gemini 2 um we've got brent out there who wanted to win the shimmer ink pads you guys can't win just to reiterate that uh, sarah don't you try and email sarah uh, email qvc prizes at craftscompanion.co.uk and we will get those out to you right let us uh, move on to a collection that i know you guys have been waiting for with bated breath you've been champing at the bit to see it you're about to see it right now the brand new sarah signature bohemian collection sarah yes oh you are literally getting first peek at the world launch on the new bohemian collection now you want to get a little bit of a feel of what it's all about out. let me show you a few of these cards okay it's this kind of it's that like mysterious kind of feel to it you're Ooh. getting these gorgeous designs Ooh, you can see it the dream catcher I'm yeah. going to do you a card in a second with a dream nice. catcher and you will absolutely go bananas when you see it at the feather by the way you've got the shimmering pads or the brand new duet ink pads they all work fabulously with it and also the glitter paste oh, they work fabulous with those glitter paste on there as well this is that dream catcher but look at it on the front here look oh, the papers oh wait till you see the papers the papers that to die for okay now we have a small bundle so what we like to do for qvc is they like to have like a, a nice introductory bundle so okay. that those of you who are wanting to get started this is a great way to start we also have a 12 by 12 paper pad and we also have some vellums in this collection so you can see this look in the booklet you'll find out all the details of the papers in the 12 by 12 albums i might start by showing you the papers and i'm going to show you the 12 by 12 pad because i want you to see them in detail oh, but then wow. actually what Hang you will on. find is you can work look, and look they're all double-sided to the oh. beautiful designs okay three sheets of each one these papers are just absolutely gorgeous trust me you are going to want multiples of these paper pads just when you thought we couldn't go better look at them i tell you what we've excelled ourselves with these ones these okay, just the background look at the the b the b track oh with the special effects in them again you've got those lovely dream catches the color palette on this one is absolutely mm -hmm. incredible and i just think if you love that if you've got friends who are into the bohemian feel if you love it yourself and you want to make some beautiful designs and you want oh, these wow. lovely background papers these are absolutely fabulous now we yeah. will be doing full feature presentations with these on live on crafters tv throughout the month of may yeah bear in mind you are seeing world launches on qvc next wednesday 
this is the big headline item for the six o'clock show that headline item that is going to be the world launch is going to be the premiere on the six o'clock show i'm fully expecting this to be really popular very very busy and you can get this you can have it delivered to you and you could be crafting along with us live when we do our first show um, on this on crafters tv a few weeks later okay so that is the 12 by 12 pad bear in mind we also have a vellum collection so if i just take out the vellum Ooh, stack yeah. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Um, I'm going to show you this onto the white, I think, right? Okay. It's beautiful, same sort of papers, yeah. right? So it's all the same paper designs, but those beautiful kind of intense prints on the vellum finish here, okay? So you've got all the vellum in that set. So it's 36 sheets in your um, 12 by 12 pad. It's a 24 sheet pack of the vellum. The uh, six by six pad, now, now I'm going on to the main collection. It's exactly the same but in the smaller version of the print. So these are card fronts, kind of ready and raring to go is the yeah. best way to look at it, Ben. So mm. I just think that this is coming in your collection. Now, not only do you get the six by six pad, right? You get that dream catcher deck. This is the one you're all gonna go bananas for, right? Just wait till I show you. Will I do a card with you with this in just a second, right? Isn't that incredible? We've then got this wonderful kind of background stamp. Now, if I just show you a card with this, look at that. That's amazing. And it's a continuation, so you can kind of, can you see it's been stamped there and then continued here? Oh, uh, yes. With the feathers coming down, how incredible. I mean, it's, it's not just one of the most, who's made this card here? Curry Noon. Wow. Curry, that is fabulous. Uh, she's used also some bits of the Gilding Flakes, which I will show you. There is a whole Gilding Flakes Clever. set. So in your Gilding Flakes set, you get these two colours. So you get the lovely pink. Let me show you them here. You get a special shade of gold that matches and also the pink. That's immense, the shine, isn't it? But you're going to get the drying pad, which means you can stamp with this and you also get the, uh, the pad on here. Now we've also got this set of tassels. Right, so it's actually a 12 piece tassel set. These are gonna be wonderful, really beautifully made. We haven't done anything like this before. No. So you get the 12 piece tassel set in here. You're also gonna get that lovely big feather, which you saw me use uh, on one of the, was it, uh, what was the project that I put? This was it here, wasn't it? Look at that lovely big feather. So oh, I incredible. said that would be brilliant if you use it with your ink pads. And the embossing folder, right? And you've wow. also got this lovely die with the fan shape on there. Yeah. Now, I've only got a couple of minutes left, so I must go and do you a really quick card. I want you to see that lovely big die in use, right? So, got a base die here, a base card. Can you see this is designed to cut in as an edgeable? So what you do is this goes into the front panel of your card kind of like this, okay? So I'm going to take it like this. Notice my card is bigger. Do not worry, I'm going to show you how we're going to cut that down the edge. I'm going to hold my tape on the bit that's going to cut away. Yep. Open this right out, and this is going to go straight into my Gemini, right? Okay. So I'm cutting into the base cutting plate. I'm going with my frosted. I'm going to add my magnetic sheet on here, top sheet, and then straight into the G2. In the G2. In the G2. Get in the G2, and we are going straight. Now imagine... You get your Bohemian delivered, right? What day is the uh, Bohemian show going to be on Crafters TV? Well, see if we can find the details. You could be Fourth watching it 4th of May. So the next day, you could be watching it live on here whilst you are crafting along. Living the dream. With the products on your Gemini 2. Yes. That, that was the vision when we put this together, okay? Now, let me lift this out because I want you to see how fabulous this is going to look, okay? This is going to lift out from here like this. All that detailed die cutting in there, all right? Uh, oh, I'm just going to pull you off here, right? Just going to tear you from there. Because what I want you to see is, I then bring in my scissors, Ben, and just follow that cutting line up to the edge of this panel here. And obviously, you're going to pop all those little bits out. Of you're not going to. You're going to sit with your porky tool and pop them out, right? Here is the one I've done where I've popped all those bits out. So can you see? It forms like an edgeable, yeah. but with all that lovely detail. Now, all I'm going to do is use some of that beautiful. Uh, I'm using a B track from the background here. Cool. Look at that there. So actually, let's go straight for it. I'm going to use a little bit of tape down the sides here. I'm going to stick that on there. Mm -hmm. Now, I think that looks nice. What will make it really stand out? Cut it a second time in the gold, which I have done here, oh, right? Immense. Now, dotty tape pens, right? I'm going to use my dotty tape pen all the way around the outside here. So we've got plenty of stick 
all the way down here, all right? Now, as well as that, I can then take this, put some of my regular tape all the way around the outside, and this will just ever so slightly offset yeah. underneath, all right? So I'm just going to slightly offset just to the side here, on the base here, and that will get, yes, that is what I was after there, that lovely just offset panel. And then again, all you're doing is taking a little bit of tape, we're going to go straight down. Let's just pop this at the bottom where I've got some of the little gems on here. Going to go down to the bottom panel there. The tassels. Oh, of course. I've got one of the tassels. I've just used a little die cut piece. Look here. And all I'm going to do is a nice globule of 3D glue gel, which does come in, by the way, if you're going for those um, oh, topper pads. Yeah, yeah. That's going to go onto there. And now that is going to hold that. Once that dries, that's going to hold the tassel in place. And then look, I've got one of the nice sentiments. Be true to you. Stamped and uh, gilded flaked because you've got the uh, ink pad included in there. I'm just going to take that. I'm going to go up into that top corner. That's stunning, and I it? want you to see just how fabulous that yeah. card That with that dream catcher, I just think is amazing. My goodness me. That is a beautiful project from... I mean, how amazing is this collection? It is going to absolutely fly. Look at that card again. I can't, come on, take the dream catcher is incredible. Isn't it? With that gold behind, how simple. Yeah. And this is the thing, right? Okay, so we've made, it's the small collection. It's brilliant. You go, and as soon as it's live on QVC, guys, because I know a lot of you will want to order it, have it delivered along with your Gemini, crafting along with us live when we do our show on the 4th, right? So if that is you, I suggest you get yourself into that Facebook group. So fans of Crafters Companion on QVC, if you're not already in it, if you aren't in the UK, guys, you're not allowed to join. I'm really sorry. Those of you watching in the US, we have our fan group for our Crafters Companion fans on HSN. But if you do, if you join the, uh, the details on the bottom of your screen, you can go and join us in that group. As soon as these items go live, we will let you know. You can get yours ordered. We'll get our shipments out to you. They come direct from our warehouse here in the UK we drop them straight directly to you fantastic shipping rates they we do a really great job with QVC we do it's it, you pay shipping per item but it's kept to a minimum and if you do go for things like the extra vellum or the extra papers it's usually only 99p mm. for each additional item for shipping and handling so it works out really well oh my goodness the more I see I just adore this collection I can't wait to get my hands on it says Charlotte Susie says this has got everything I love 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 it Sarah, Sarah says diamonds are not my best friend Crafters Companion is lol. Yeah. Uh, Kim says, one of the best collections I have seen for a long time. Ooh, fight and talk. Yeah. Judy Barley says, this collection looks wonderful. Uh, my budget will have to stretch for this. Don't worry about budgets on, on Tuesday and Wednesday. Budgets, don't worry about those. Get what you want, get what you need. Um, I'm going to give this away, and then we've got one quick more item to show you, and then uh, we're going to find out who has won the Gemini 2. But who's won the Bohemian collection? Well, uh, John at random on YouTube uh, for a comment of, can I book Kiri in for the Bohemian craft along. Yes, Hannah Gosling Smith, you can because you've just won it. Uh, picked it random. So, congratulations, Hannah and Kira. You'll enjoy uh, crafting with that, I'm sure. Message us uh, right now, QVC Prizes at crafterscompanion.co.uk and we'll get that sent out to you. Um, one final thing to show you, and hang fire because we're going to announce who has won. I can't believe I'm saying this. Uh, we're going to announce who has won the Gemini 2 in just a few moments' time. Uh, before that, a quick look through a uh, Sarah Signature Discovery bag, which is going to be coming up uh, in the 3 o'clock hour on uh, Wednesday. And this, again, is just a lovely, lovely collection of well, lots of different items from lots of different collections, Sarah, and you've obviously, you know, popped uh, lots of different bits and pieces in here so people can have a bit of a taste of the different collections. Yes, and that's a bit why of a we call it. Different ideas. Yeah, we call it the Discovery Bag. Just as you're showing everybody, uh, you will look at that and I'll tell you all about it. Yeah. We call it the Discovery Bag so that you can trial a little bit of everything. So trial one of the Gilding Flake sets, trial some of our beautiful lace. Then <coughs> I want you to try some of the dyes that we have in the different collections. So yeah. We've got some lovely edgeables in here. You'll see I've also put, so, and I've put different styles of edgeables. So it's not necessarily things that are all going to work together, but it's going to give you a little sampler of everything that you have from so many of our different collections. So you can go for the Bohemian if you want brand new. If you want to try a few different elements, and look, I've tried to match in, like, 
like I've given you the party as well as giving you that um, edgeable balloon. So you've got the ones that are going to work together in there. Yeah. But I think the great thing about Sarah Signatures is we do include lots of different items from the range, like our lovely vellums. Gorgeous, isn't and, it? And I just think it's a, it's a great way if you are new to working with us. We've got thousands of customers watchers on QVC who've never never crafted before. People who've crafted before but never tried Crafters Companion before. So we've done this discovery bag for you to try a little bit of everything, like our flower forming form, like you've got some of our dyes, like you've got the different vellums in there, like you've got some of our, um, look, look, we've even put the stamens in there so that you can do the florals yeah. that go with it. I've tried to, when I've put this bag together, I've tried to look at everything we've got in stock of the last two or three collections that we've got in, and I, I can't give you all of one collection, but I can give you a bit of this, bit of that, bit of the other, and it's a discovery, so it's at a really, really good price. It is a fraction of the price that it would be if you went to one of our stores and bought all those components individually. Um, it's a lovely, lovely collection, and you will find out more about it in the booklet. And of course, at three o'clock um, on uh, Wednesday. Of course, don't forget Tuesday for the big launch, nine p.m. Um, if I know the majority of you've got the booklet by now, if you haven't downloaded it, make sure you get it. One hundred and forty-six pages in there with everything that you need to know and more. Join the Facebook group as well, uh, UK viewers. Like Sarah said, fans of Crafts Companion on QVC group definitely worth joining. And, and as I've mentioned. Pretty much all day Wednesday, Sarah, uh, midnight, then 9 a.m., 1 p.m., 3 p.m., 6 p.m. and 9 p.m. You have to remember all of that. It's in the booklet. And, of course, you can watch QVC online, qvcuk.com, or uh, you can watch it on TV, of course. It's Freeview Channel 16. Uh, if you've got Sky, it's 660 uh, and FreeSat 800. So those are all of the uh, the channels for you. Um, just before we say a massive thank you to Sarah, we are going to give away uh, the Gemini 2. <laughs> I've never done anything so exciting, I don't think. This is very, very exciting. Um, so it's a signed Gemini 2, um, along with um, the uh, the butterfly blooms as well. So you're going to get everything oh. included. Uh, this person commented on YouTube um, saying, sorry, you've done an amazing job with this one. It's going to be my fave, I think. Congratulations. Winning the signed Gemini 2. Charlotte Everett! Yes! yes. Well done! Charlotte, we will get that signed and sent straight out to you. Now, if you are not Charlotte, I'm really, really sorry that you didn't win the Gemini 2. However, if you want to be one of the first people in the country to mm -hmm. get a Gemini 2, you need to be getting it from QVC. So here's the thing, just like, so so we did the, it's like a global launch we did with Curate, who is the parent company of HSN QVC. QVC, um, it said in America, they did the launch on the 28th of March. QVC are launching it now. It's still another month away from its official launch date into the rest of the market. So if you want to get ha your hands on the machine a month before the official launch, you want to be one of the founding members into the Gemini Club. You want to be using this when everyone else is only just talking about it and waiting for it. And if you want the best deal, because you could... Not only are you buying the machine, but you're going to get the turntable, you're going to get access to the Gemini Club, and you're going to get that first Butterfly Booms box. Then you need to be getting this as the TSV from QVC, either on Tuesday when it launches, or as soon as that TSV, sometimes QVC do their TSV pricing live a couple of days ahead. A little bit different to ATM, but if they do, we will be sure to let you guys know. It's going to be an amazing day. A massive thank you to Sarah. Thank you to all the team as well. What a show this has been. Massive thank you to Rachel and Susie and Taylor and John and Brent and Tracy and also to Nicola and uh, Liam um, helping to put this fantastic show together. And thank you to you guys as well because um, there's been some lovely comments coming through. Um, so many of you just appreciating this show. Uh, Julie says, thank you for a fantastic two hours. Uh, B Mumby says, oh my Lord, I'm going to be ordering like crazy. Uh, and Faye Park saying to Sarah and Ben, thank you very much for a wonderful Wonderful show. Well, thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure you join Sarah on QVC um, Tuesday night, nine o'clock here in the UK, and pretty much all day on the Wednesday. And don't forget, the fun isn't over yet here at Crafters Companion. If you switch over to the main Crafters TV page in 35 seconds' time, uh, you will be able to join uh, Sheena, uh, also Lily and Leanne, for a beautiful beginning show. Of course, Sheena Wednesdays. We're very excited to have Sheena Douglas back with us, uh, so you can catch that amazing show uh, in 20 seconds' time. So I'll leave you here give you the opportunity to switch over uh, join the ladies and i'll see you back on crafters tv tomorrow but once again massive thank you to sarah uh, massive thank you to you uh, we'll see you very soon bye for now